Well, 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 welcome everybody to Song of the Prairie. We are finally here with some early access look at Song of the Prairie, game that just came out on, uh, I guess, April 7th um, everywhere, but, you know, April 6th in some other parts of the world as well. But Song of the Prairie, here a new farming game that we're going to be playing and uh, checking out today. It's going to be great fun. Um, so, yeah, I hope you all are, uh, you all are ready for this. Um, yeah. Should be uh oh I just accidentally exited the game. Whoops. <laughs> Should be fun. Um I had played the demo uh with this in, in, in some time. Yeah. I have it's been a while uh, since the last time I played the demo, very long while. Uh but it should be good. We should have a good time today. Now there's a few things I want to go over with this before we dive right into it, uh for sure. Um How you doing? Yeah, how's it going everybody? Um Oh Oh, hang on a sec. What's happening? Okay, let's 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 restart, shall we? Let, let's let's restart. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Holy crap. Okay, sorry. Let me just I had to restart the entire system. Everything got all backed up. It was kind of crazy. Oh my lord. Um, we're back. Yeah. Uh, by the way, uh, uh, like everything is happening all at once. It's kind of crazy. I don't know what's happening to like YouTube right now. But big shout out to Mouse in a Bikini with the ten ten gifted membership bomb. Ten gifted membership bomb there. Love to see that. Look at you. Thank you for for that. That was very kind. You're very kind indeed. Big ups to you, uh, indeed. So thank you for that. Uh, Bounce and bikini. That was very very kind of you. And thank you, Mary, for the. For the, uh, for the re-up on the five months as well. Yeah, the mouse in bikini. How are you doing? Good to see you. Welcome in. Welcome in indeed. Oh my goodness gracious. I hope everyone's doing fine. Um, yeah, sorry about that, folks. We kind of just got a little bit sidetracked there. <sighs> yeah. Is everything going right? Yeah, it's a little bit funky, you know? It's, YouTube's kind of acting a little weird today, no? Hang on. We're going to let it uh, catch up with us today. My lord. Holy lord. <clears throat> How's it going, everyone? Good to see you. Yeah, good to see you. Indeed. Hi, how you doing? Good to see you. Welcome, welcome in. It's like the song of the ever tree. Ooh. Hmm. Uh, Mary says, happy early Easter. Yeah, good. Happy early Easter to you as well. Yeah. Yeah, good to see you. Good to see you. So let me know. Let me know. <clears throat> How's it going in the chat? Everybody doing well? Uh, the stream's kind of acting a little, little, like, it's getting a little... It's, it's waking up on a Friday morning. Let's be real here, right? Come on now. I think there's a bunch of things happening all at once is, is what's happening here. There's so much things going on here for the Song of the Prairie. By the way, Chaucer the Bastard, thank you for becoming a member of the channel. We really, 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 really do appreciate that. Thank you very much. Very kind indeed. Uh, let me know how the stream is too, if everything's going well. And Mouse and Bikini with the massive, massive tier, the biggest tier that we have and becoming welcome to the business here that's very kind of you mouse in a bikini that incredible how you doing that's very very sweet of you as well <clears throat> so 10 gifted memberships we got a couple of re-ups um we got new members coming in thank you very much i'm sorry i'm so sorry uh that you know it might be uh you know the the, the system's just getting hit hard here but my lord uh yeah good to see everyone <laughs> Good to see everyone. Uh, but no, with Song of the Prairie, <clears throat> there's a lot of different things going on with this here in Early Access. We'll kind of get into this here in a sec. The music will come back. Don't worry about that. Uh, there's a couple things I want to read about it. I'm assuming the stream is fine now because nobody has said otherwise. So I'm going to continue with my little spiel here. Song of the Prairie is a 3D relaxing farm game. A hero who defeats the demon begins a new rural life. Experiencing the fun of exploration to the town, harvesting gr giant fruits and crops, taking care of fantastic animals, dating with someone like dating with someone you like, and just enjoy the farming life only belongs to you. This is developed by the Droplet Studio and published by AOE Plus. Yes, AOE Plus. Yeah, so that's that's what we got here with Song of the Prairie. This is an early access game. It's uh, $19.99 USD. You can pick it up for 10% off for the first seven days for $17.99 USD. All that good stuff. Um, I think they had like a little bit of a hotfix this morning, I believe. 
Uh, they have a Discord, so you can follow them on Discord as well. Uh, there's a couple things I want to talk about, though, like I said, about this game um, that some people might not know. Um, so they plan on having this game in early access for at least one year. That's their goal. Uh, but they have said that it's not a guarantee. So it could be more than a, more than a year um, before we see the full version of the game. <clears throat> Uh, how will the full version, uh, you know, differ from, I guess, what are some things that they want to add uh, in early access? And just a few things kind of they, they list here. They want to have new animals. They want to have new plants uh, come eventually. They want to have new custom content, which I don't know what that is. Uh, they want to have new NPCs. They want to have new stories and things like that. Um, it, it seems like in the future, they also want to have marriage and love system uh, to make the interaction more vivid. Honestly, I thought the love and marriage system would have been in the game already, but apparently that's something they want to add later down the road. So, spoiler on that, and hopefully I didn't crush everybody's dreams with that. Um, they also want to add new NPCs and related stories uh, in the future, and all they say is rich mount gameplay. I don't know what rich mount gameplay is. But this is everything that's kind of said right here off of the Steam. Uh, it just says uh, future improvements they want to add they plan on adding marriage and love system to make the interaction more vivid now i thought that would is going to be that one was going to be in but it does say it right here that they plan on adding that in the future uh towards i guess full version who knows i haven't played the game yet i guess we'll learn together maybe it's already in the game who knows um <clears throat> they did say also about uh, song of the prairie that uh, they do plan on raising the price once it does go full version so, um, you know, $19.99 USD now, but they did say they plan on raising the price of this game when it does hit 1.0. Yeah, seems like there's a lot of things they want to add to this game, and it seems like uh, it seems pr promising to the, you know, for the most part. Um, it's full controller support, so if you need a controller, if you can't do the keyboard and mouse, you can absolutely do it for sure. And that's pretty much the information I have to give to you, at least relayed straight from the developers themselves. A song of the prairie i guess we'll have to see all together right yeah okay <laughs> all right i think we're just about ready to go ahead and start so yeah good to see you good to see everybody alex dragon ruth queen meow michael chibi steven crawford anti meow uh borislav how you doing how's it going natalie sharon lloyd what's going on asia white how you doing fiona Suze? did i say susie well you maybe got another one now susie uh isabel how you doing uh eliza how you doing kalia what's going on serendipity q uh gigglefish what's going on and then the massive 10 membership bomb which is insane uh jordan uh melanie Oh my god, there's a lot of people. <laughs> How you doing, Yasmin? How you doing, Andrew? <clears throat> my lord, there's a lot. I can't keep up with everybody. Suhiko, how you doing, Suhiko? Malachi, how's it going? Rosa, how you doing, Rosa? Jonathan, how you doing, Jonathan? Jasmine, how you doing, Jasmine? Funny games. Um, then I, I mean, I, I probably missed someone. Aries, how you doing, Aries? What's going on? Good to see you. Kitty Rice, how you doing, Kitty Rice? What's going on? What's going on? Casey Cozy Corner says, finally caught a live stream. I've been watching your Wildflower streams. Oh, that's a good series. That's a very good series. Good choice. Lady Phoenix. How you doing, Lady Phoenix? What's going on? Yeah, so I'm assuming the stream is all good and we're ready to go. So let's go ahead and jump into Song of the Prairie. Gigglefish says, have a feeling you're about to cost me some money showing me this game. <laughs> Nautica Davis. How you doing, Nautica Davis? What's going on? Excuse me? She laughed before she says, I seem to have slept for a long time. I don't think she was really laughing, but... Help High Gaming, how you doing, Help High Gaming? How you doing, Jazzy G? What's going on? Hey, Aris. Hey, Maggie Mae. Hey, Penguin. What? Hey, it's you who disturbed my sweet dreams. Hmm, aren't you the legendary hero who saved the world? Well, yes, yes, I am. You have legendary fame, great power, but they also brought you endless hassles. Now go back, as this is my territory. I won't allow you to bring the hassle here. Hassles here. Very well. Hey, Amanda, me. How you doing, Amanda? I'm willing to hide my identity, or I am willing to conceal my power. 
I'm willing to hide my identity or I'm willing to conceal my power. Spider-Man. Has the glory been a thing of the past for you? Interesting. You've already been the most powerful person in the continent. Now, you must choose anonymity. Anom oh my lord. And a man... And a... Look. Don't brick around. What's here that makes you so persistent? What's here that makes you so persistent? A life for me or a true friend? I'm not here for a friend. I'm here for a life for me. I'm going to take a little bit of a selfish uh, take there. Hey, Phelan. I'm surprised a human hero would desire a peaceful life like this. I would be shocked if they found out. The world would be shocked if they found out. All right, you passed. I will allow you to hide your past and become a member of this land. Well, I appreciate it. It's about time. I ought to go back to sleep now. However, we'll meet again when the time comes. All right. Hey, Moonflower, how you doing? Good to see you. Hey, Arcadia, how you doing, Arcadia? How you, how you doing? You sleep? Oh. I didn't expect you to fall asleep ungu unguardedly in front of a stranger. Just like an old friend of mine. <clears throat> However, that guy probably doesn't have the time to come to this kind of place right now. After all, that's a hero, admired by everyone. I will talk over them. The abandoned farm finally got a new owner. Shocking. The mine in the back hill reveals I don't know what the rest of that said. Finally, I found it. <laughs> Are we having carrot soup? I must hurry up. Time is running out. Hi. Hello. Nice, nice, very cool. <clears throat> nice. Very cool. It seems cozy, doesn't it? It seems a little nice, yeah? I, I like, I like... Yeah, I, 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 I do, I do, I like the art style, I'm, I'm digging it. Congratulations, your resume shows that you have met the requirements of our town. After we verify your information, you can become the new owner of a farm. Well, that's incredible. And Zari's, Zari's decided to gift the five memberships. Oh my goodness gracious. Zari's coming up with the five gifted membership. Mouse in a bikini and Zari's coming in hot with the gifted memberships. Look at y'all. That was very kind of you, Zari's. Big ups to you. Big ups to you indeed. Thank you for that. Appreciate that. Oh yeah, that's right. I remember now. Okay. So you could choose these three different characters. Oh, this is gonna be wonderful. So there's Kelly, Burgess. These are the only two. Kelly and Burgess, and then I guess Winnie. Once you unlock Winnie. Mmm. Very cool. So Kelly is a gardener. Gardener from the state of freedom. Has an incredible close relationship with the land. The ability, the initial planting proficiency level is D. Planting proficiency experience plus one extra. Default settings, health points 100. Money 3000. Energy 160. Does everybody start with 3000? Okay, at least between Burgess and Kelly. Hey! Happy Easter to you and your family. Hope you have a great weekend. That was very kind of you. Thank you, Mouse in a Bikini. Happy Easter to you and hope you and your family have a wonderful weekend as well. Absolutely. Happy Easter to you, too. And thank you for the generosity you've, you've shown today. Appreciate that as well. Arcadia got a membership. Look at that. That's so good. So State of the Freedom, located in the west of the mainland, it is a federal state led by many nobles, advocating freedom and adventurism and boasting self-expression, which is a paradise for artists and adventures. So that's Kelly. Burgess, 
Voyager, a voyager from the country, uh, country of the sea, has been to many sea areas and has special fishing skills. Oh, fishermen do we have? The initial fishing proficiency level is D. Fishing proficiency experience plus one extra. Uh, starting with the same uh, health points, energy, and money. Country of the sea, a coastal country on the north side of the continent. People here love poetry and stories and greatly value families. They believe all things have spirit. They worship their ancestors and believe that the spirits of their ancestors will protect the descendants. How you doing, awful gaming? Good to see you. I want to know more about Winnie, who apparently is a tailor. Interesting. So I guess you go either go farming or you go fishing on this matter. I have a feeling maybe farming is, is, is the way to go. This is the way, right? Has to be. Yeah, has to be. I want to do the gardener, right? Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at this. Look at this. Customization. Oh, yo, yo. This looks pretty cool. Oh, look at that hairstyle. Look at that. All right, let's get it going here, shall we? Let's do it. Mm -mm -mm. I need Danielle in the room now. I do. I need Danielle in the room. I do like... I do, yeah, I do. I do. Give me like a little bit of... Yeah. I don't know what's what's considered cute. <laughs> for, for, you know? Oh, you know what? Let's see if we do like... Maybe like purple end highlights. Something like that. Yeah. How you like that? All right. I'm digging it. Face. Oh, <laughs> How did you know? How did you know, game? Probably the best slider I've ever seen in any video game ever. No, no, no. Give me this one. Sick, dude. <laughs> eyes? Those are soft eyes. Oh, my lord. Yo, she has, like, flowers in her eyes. Those are adorable. Pupil color. Fantastic question. Maybe you have purple. Sort of. Kind of match the little bit of highlights in the in the hair. Kind of. Thing. Maybe, like, a deep purple. I kind of like it. Lips. And then you give, oh God, not two big lips. That looks good, yeah? Skin tone? You can be any color you want too. I think you even be purple. We'll just leave it on the default. I might change the eyes a bit. That looks good, yep. Yep, I'm liking that better. Eyebrows? I'm taking my time with this, as you can probably tell. Nose. Won't get too into that. Special looks. Yo, you can have like... It's like a cat, dude. I don't know what that did. I don't know where that's located. That's located somewhere. Same with that. Kind of like the flower. Let's do the flower, yo. Actually, no. I'm not going to do the flower. If I was able to change the color, maybe. But I'm not. So I'm going to leave it as is. What's your name? Only Chinese or English can be used in characters' names. The length allowed is 8 Chinese characters or 16 English uh, characters. <clears throat> Interesting. Um... What's a what's a good name, I guess? What would be a Done. Your date of birth? Let's do kind of like real life. 
Winter 22nd? Send it. Cool. Alright. Well, there's our character. There you go. There we go. <laughs> oh. Oh, look at look at her. Look at her in the game. She looks good. Wallace, congratulations for becoming the new owner of the farm. In order to welcome you, the mayor has been waiting for you on the farm. Did you see the bus stop ahead? This is for the convenient public transportation of our town. Piggy Express! Oh my god, Piggy Express. If only it had to do with, like, guinea pigs and stuff. All town residents can use it for free. Without further ado, let's ride it to the farm now. Oh, dude, I'm on it. Let's get on the Piggy Express. Kenzella, good afternoon. Well, thank you. Dude, the music is kind of, like... A little bit. Right? It's kind of bumping a bit. So please use the Piggy Express. I will. So go to the... F wow, look at the map. Holy crap. Farm station it is. Whoops. Now let's go and take a look at the farm first. The mayor is waiting for us. So the farm station must be our farm, maybe? Yeah? <laughs> I wanted to see the actual Piggy, like, take us. Are we here? Please move to the Piggy Express. Now let's go and take a look at the farm first. The mayor is waiting for us. It's fine. It's fine. How you doing, Molly? What's going on, Molly? Hey, Tolga. How you doing, Tolga? Oh, my lord. Look at that thing. This is your farm. What do you think? Isn't it good? Although it looks a bit deserted now, I believe that as long as you take good care of it, it will soon be restored uh, to life. The mayor should be uh, taking care of the wheat by the gate of the farm. But uh, let's go find him. Let's do it. Oh my god, dude, look at that. Is that corn in this world? Is this Mayor Hart? Who's Hart? Yo, look at her. She's a little bit sassy looking now, isn't she? Oh, this is Wallace still. <laughs> I didn't even notice her character model. I can't believe he fell asleep again. He clearly said that he wanted to make a good impression on the newcomer. Kenzella, please forgive him. For the sake of the farm, the mayor hasn't had a good night's sleep for a long time. So let's be a bit more understanding, shall we? I guess so. I understand you're tired. Thank you. You're such a sensible person. I think the mayor will make up. Mm, will wake up on his own in a while. Okay, right. So we'll just let him sleep on our farm. God, Wallace, uh, who, who did you bring? Uh, why didn't you wake me up? Mayor, this is our new farmer, Kenzella. She is a gentle and considerate person. And she is... The one who told me not to disturb you. Hmm. Am I right? Hmm. Anyway, this is still too rude to a newcomer. Uh, hello, young person. I'm Hart, the mayor here. The young people in town like to call me Uncle Hart, if you don't mind. You can too. So, Uncle Hart. Interesting. As a newcomer, you must have many questions. I wonder if you are interested in listening to me give a brief introduction to this town. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm open. Let's do it. I knew it. No one could resist curiosity about a small town. The legend of the goddess circulating here once attacked many people. That was a legend a long time ago. Wallace, now, the m most important thing in our town is a peaceful and plentiful rule at life. But for today's young people, uh, this may be unappealing. Mayor, what are you saying in front of the newcomer? There is no place more charming than this land. I believe Kenzella will fall in love with it right away. You are still the same. When you hear the when you hear the bad words about the town, you are all you are full of fighting spirit. This is also your strength. Kanzella, Wallace has high hopes for you. I, I hope so. Mayor, don't stick to these unimportant things. Don't you see that our Kanzella is a little tired? That is a kind of a strange name that I've now given our character, isn't it? By the way, thanks uh, subs for subscribing, Precious R. Could it be that you got lost again and took our newcomer to run a big circle around the town? That was a year ago. No, I... 
I don't get lost. We, we were just touring. Don't be shy. A few cute little imperfections only make you even more charming. Oh, baby. That's right. By the way, the cottage in the back in your new home, we've cleaned it up for you. Oh, this is it? All right. When you have time, you can slowly arrange it to your liking. I'm happy to visit visit as your guest at that time. Oh, at that time. Okay, very well. Young person, this may be your first time living on a farm, but don't worry. Life is all about starting from scratch and having fun growing up. Yeah, that's exactly what life is all about. Starting from from nothing and, and, and having fun growing up. Yep, seeing you like, like see, seeing you is like seeing my younger self. It reminds me of the lost youth. I've also worked on a farm and even won first place in the town's best plow, plow pose contest. Sorry, you got first place in the best plow contest? Um, oh my lord. Did you pull that out of your pants, young man? Just like this. Oh, don't show it to me. My lord, what is happening here? Sorry, is that your head or is that a wig? Ah, it's a wig. The wind is a bit noisy today. My head always wants to breathe fresh air. Wallace, it's almost time. I have to go back to the guild to deal with the rest of the work. As for our newcomer, I'll leave it to you to teach her how to work on the farm. All right. Very well. Hey, Darren, how you doing, Darren? Did I say hello to Molly? Well, hello, Molly. If I didn't, I'm sorry. Hey, Summer Sunshine, how you doing, Summer? Hey, Serendipity, how you doing, Serendipity? Hey, James, how you doing, James? Wallace's friendship points increase. Planting instructions. Use a hoe to aim at the empty land and press the cultivate button, right? <clears throat> On the tilled land, take out the seed bag you want, okay? Use a kettle, they call it a kettle, to aim the planted land and press water. <laughs> After the crops are mature, press F to harvest. Open the settings interface. You can choose to display or hide the harvest icon. Oh, okay. So I guess if you were like got, I guess annoyed with seeing like, oh, these are ready to harvest. You can turn those off. Okay, very cool. I didn't expect the mayor to reveal his biggest secret so quickly. He wanted to make a good impression on you. He must be depressed. I'll deliver the hat to him when I'm free. But for now, I'll teach you how to farm. Um, he didn't pick up his hat off the ground. Yeah, let's do the tutorial, absolutely. Don't worry, step by step I will teach you how to be, uh, become a competent farmer. This is a hoe for you. Let's start by hoeing. Let's do it. Hey, Purple Panther, how you doing, Purple Panther? By the way, thank you, Nutopengs, Nutopengs, for subscribing as well. Is that corn slumps over? Corn slumps over. There's what's happening in that field. I think it's like, uh, yeah, I think it's like corn slumped over. The, the thing about this game is <clears throat> it's gonna be a little bit different than your farming sim type game. I think it's gonna be more fantasy based, uh, more fantasy themed, so to speak. Did you see my demonstration? If you use a hoe on cultivated land, un on uncultivated land, you can cultivate it uh, for farming. I will leave the rest to you. Give it a try. Yeah, I could do that for sure. I just send it, right? That's a send. Yeah, I got this. No problem. Now, already immediately, my question to myself and everybody else is, will you be able to uh, change your outfit and stuff in this game? <laughs> That's a great question that I hope that we get the answer to eventually. Great job. You have successfully uh, cultivated this piece of land, and we are one step closer to our goal. Next, let's see how in the cultivated land, let's try it with this bag of radish seeds. Okay. <clears throat> Press the number key. Okay, yeah, we're, we're very well with that. Let's see here. So we want to send it with one and just kind of... I love how... Look at that. Look at her. Look how she holds that. That's adorable. Look at that. No big deal. For seeds to thrive, one thing is essential. I'm sure you've guessed it. Water. Now switch to the tool the newly acquired kettle and water the soil after sowing. Okay. As before, I'll distribute, dist uh, demonstrate first. Kenzella, please watch me carefully. <laughs> Such a weird name. Purple Panther says, 11 months. Oh my god. I've been watching this forehead for all for a year. Almost been watching this forehead for a year. Oh my lord. One whole year. Big shout out to you, Purple Panther. Big shout. Hope you're doing well. Hope all is well. Hope all is well with you and, and the baby too, right? Yeah, yeah. Soon. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> When the seeds get enough water, they will start to grow. 
The plot of the land that has already been watered will darken in color and does not need to be watered again today. Seeds will only grow quickly if they get enough water. Now, try it yourself. Okay, so is it one? Yeah, one spot at a time. There we go. Oh, look at that. I, I, you know what? It, it's kind of different, right? Where, like, the crops are massive. They're big, right? They're huge. I kind of like it, though. It, it's kind of fun. What the heck was that? That one had a rainbow. Yeah, I, I kind of like the big, you know, exaggerated crops here. There we go. Nice. Eight weeks to go before Grayson's here. Oh, it's too exciting. Too exciting. You are more talented than I thought. Maybe you will become planting expert in the future. Don't forget to water these radishes every day so you can harvest them in a few days. Now, I wonder if you were to, to play as the uh, fisherman, do you go through this process still? Or do you go through a different process? <clears throat> I think I saw Finding Nemo. See the box at the door? At 5 o'clock every afternoon, someone will come to collect the goods. You just put the things you need to sell into the box and you can get paid uh, the next day. Kind of like every game out there, Harvest Moon, Stardew Valley, all that good stuff. How to ship a product. We're very, very uh, familiar with that. How to make money. Growing crops is a way to make money. You can go to... You can go to... Don't want to open general store? Wait, what? That's the name of the general store? Don't want to open? To buy the seeds you need and plant them on the farm? Okay. <laughs> so these are the mayor's gift for you. Hope you can take good care of your farm in the future. In order to help you get used to the farm life soon, the mayor has prepared a diary book for you and has left some small tasks on the memo page in it. Go ahead and take a look. So press Q to open up the diary and click the memo on the interface to view the current tasks and things like that. Very good. Harvest proficiency. So is that our memo? So please make 50 shipments. Please harvest 30 units of crops. And I guess we get flax seeds in return. Young person, did you see the shipping box by the gate? Don't forget to find me in town after you completed the 50 shipments. I will give you some flax seeds. Very well. So this is like the main story. We got extended story, which I'm assuming is like side quests. And then you have like a contract, I guess. Contracts. Who the heck are you? Power? Power? Interesting. Memo diary interpersonal? Must be... Friendships? Is there 24 people in this game? By the way, Carmen... Carmen, thank you for becoming a member of the channel. I appreciate that, Carmen. That was very nice of you. How you doing, Carmen? Good to see you. Welcome in. Welcome in, Carmen. How you doing? Big ups to you. Big ups to you. Is this early access? This is early access. Yeah. Oh, relationship. Wallace's relationship? What is the relationship between them? Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Calendar? Who's the first one? Today is the birthday of Freya. Remember to prepare a gift for Freya. Looks like there's the annual... Damn it. There's the annual fishing contest. I wonder if that would have been good if you were to pick the fisherman, right? Look at these other character portraits, though. I'm kind of cheating a little bit without introducing myself to them, but... Um, Freya. Looks like there's someone named Rode. Someone named Abby. Lori. Moso. Moso. Croc. Lindy. Tuya, Tuya, Jin, Becky. Oh, there's a Becky in this town. Heart, <laughs> Watermelon Festival, Birthday of Hasur, Hasur, Tegj, Tej, Tej or Tegx, Chegs, Tej, Sakona, Juana and Liv. I wonder if they're twins or maybe something like that. Amy. Power, Pauline. I wonder if we share a, um, there's a festival of the flowers, I think. Yeah, flowers. Is that what that is in autumn? The battle of the cooking. Do we share a birthday with anybody? There's our birthday. We don't. Um, fireworks festival. Wallace's birthday. We have the same week as Wallace's birthday. Mod. Jiv Jivy. Do. Look at that guy's hair. That's awesome. Or... Caro, maybe her hair. Or maybe their hair. That person's hair looks pretty cool. Dude, that guy has a headband, too. 
they have a headband. Okay. Very well. I want to meet all these people, too. Yeah, absolutely. Hmm. These are all the simple tasks. I believe you will complete them in no time. I believe so, too. By the entrance of the town, there's a store called Don't Want to Open. Uh, you can buy seeds of all seasons there. Lori, the owner of the general store, has been curious about you. Why don't you go and say hello? I can show you the way. Um... Yeah, you know what? Let's... We'll take the... Yeah, we'll enter the escort mode. Sure. We'll see what that uh, function's all about. You're welcome. Everyone in the town is like my family. And now you're one of them. Helping each other out is how the family should be. How did we end up here? Did we get that little bit of backstory on how we ended up here? So, please say hello to Lori, the owner of the grocery store. It went from general store to grocery store now. Are we in escort mode then, I guess? So, press M and press X on Lori's? Oh, look up... Oh, okay. Look up location for NPCs. I guess right here? No, that's heart. We just gotta go to Lori, right? Now, that'd be kind of hard to do, right? If we have not met Lori. There's a hairstylist? Oh, that's sick. There's the general store, though. Okay, so we just kind of go down. That's the general store. Is that the right store? That's probably the right store. Yeah, so we can't really do it by looking up NPCs because we don't know anybody. So we just go down the road into the left, right? Down the road into the left. Let's do that. Can we run in this game? Oh, fantastic. There's a stamina bar. There's energy up in the top left hand corner. Okay, kind of get used to the UI. Uh, excuse me, who are you? I would like to talk to you. Oh, this is Abby. Oh, all right. Hmm. Look at her go. Hello, Abby. I have my water pail out. That's why that red square's there. <laughs> Look at this, look at this little, like, cutscene that, well, not, I mean, like, backdrop, I guess, when talking to the character. You are. Hold on, don't tell me yet. Let me figure it out. This airy and flowy hairstyle, these intelligent and determined eyes, puts the wheat shards on your feet. I got it. You must be the Ill Ill illegitimate son of the mayor? That That's your guess? And you have been separated for many years, right? You've been a drifter with no one to depend on for years? After all the hardships, you finally found that irresponsible father of yours? What are you talking about, Abby? Huh? What? Yay! I'm right! You must feel embarrassed for being called out, right? <sighs> this is not a good first introduction to uh, citizens of this town. Oh no, my deduction failed. When will I ever reach the level of my idol? What are you talking about? Let me think again. According to my investigation, the only people who have recently grown wheat on the farm are Uncle Hart and... Aww. Could it be that you are the newcomer on the farm? <laughs> Sorry, I forgot about you. My name is Abby and I'm the town's woodcutter. However, I have another identity and that is detective. Oh. Although I'm still lacking in my deductive skill, one day I will become a super well-known detective. I think what you lack is probably more than deductive skill. Okay, why are we already getting in a heated exchange? Come on now, we just got here. Huh? What else do I lack? I see. I also lack an assistant. Every detective must have an assistant around him or her. Great, timing. I will have you be my assistant then. Uh, dear assistant, now I want to deduct again. Let me guess. No, I mean I want to do another deduction. What is the thing you want to do most right now? Hmm, I got it. It's logging right now. I'll be honest with you. I am lost in this dialogue. <laughs> How on earth did you deduct this? Why are they using that word? It's a secret. If you want to know the answer, I will exchange it with a secret you know. Yay! Now, let me teach you how to log. I'm very good at it. Since you're empty-handed, I will give you my spare axe for now. Oh, that's good. New field guide unlocked. However, a friendly suggestion, if you want to become a master woodcutter, you should go to the blacksmith shop to forge an axe that is more sustainable or suitable for you. Okay. So we got an axe, I guess. When you are close to a tree, press that and it goes down. Very good. Shall I try to bop that? <laughs> uh, I'm just going to walk away from it. Oh. She's like staring at me. Continuous observation and thinking are the training of a detective. Like, you don't expect me to chop the tree down, do you, Abby? Okay, right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I need to go left. 
Sorry, I need to go left. This way. This way. Who's this person? Why can't I catch that? Wait, what? Walker. Please, don't stop. Oh, okay. All right. Well, my bad. I'm sorry, dude. Somebody's running up there. My lord. That's a lot. Oh, look at that. How to use the repair function. Press F to interact with the building to be repaired. After the materials are delivered, the building can be repaired. After the repair is completed, the building can be used normally. Oh wait, oh wait, it's something that I can repair here. Lumber and stone material in a thousand dollars. Very well. Wow, look at this place. Hello. Don't want to open <laughs> general store. <laughs> ah, glory. The sun is warm. I really want to go back to take a nap. By the oh, so she just has the attitude that she just doesn't want to be here then. By the way, I heard that a new person came to the farm today. Wallace must be busy teaching her. Oh dear. I show up. Who are you and what are you doing standing there so silently? Uh, do a self-introduction? I am terribly sorry. I have been here the whole time. No, we will self-introduce ourselves. So you are a new sister from the farm. My name is Lori. I'm the boss of this don't want to open general store. In the future, your farm can't live without me. Let's get along well. So, do you believe in telepath? What kind of question? Telepath? In fact, uh, just now I was wondering who you are. Unexpectedly, you appeared. Is it because you heard my voice? I'm kidding, of course. By the way, I also prepared a gift for you. This comfortable chair was made by Pauline from the creation workshop. It is the same as mine. Remodeling hammer? Wait a sec. Didn't she just say chair? By the way, thank you Mars for subscribing as well. If you are tired while working on the farm, just sit in the chair. Wait, you did say chair. And recover. With this wrench, you can fold up the chair. Take my gift and you will be my sister. I actually have something to trouble you. Did you see the broken station at the gate of the town? Since it broke down, people have to walk to the farm. Brother Bo Power said that it needs a lot of wood and stone to repair it. It's too troublesome for me. Can you help me repair it? When the station is repaired, it will be more convenient for Sister Kenzella to come to me later. Okay, so she can... Okay, all right. All right, all right, all right I get it. All right. Mission received. Restore the Piggy Express station. I got it. Dude, is she in a cow outfit? Or is she in a maid outfit? What the heck is going on there? Um... Purchasing and placing small items. All small items, such as wells, can be purchased from Pauline in the Creation Workshop. Press the corresponding number key to dig out the small item. Select the favored place on. Select the favored place on the farm. Okay. When there are obstacles on the ground, do not put. Do not put down small items. When there are obstacles on the ground. There's a little bit of translation, you know, hiccups going on here. I, 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 I get it. So Sleepy. Oh, look at her umbrella, though. Oh, it's fantastic. So Sleepy, uh, you choose what you want. Uh, okay. Do you have any tasks for us? Please help Lori restore the Piggy Express. So that's the one thing that she wants. We will get 2,000 gold in return. Got it. But I do want to actually, um, you know, get some of that, uh, that crops going, right? Yeah, let's get the crops rolling. Grocery store, cabbage seeds, white radish seeds, onion seeds, spinach seeds, round onion seeds, wheat seeds, flax seeds, cauliflower, tomato, cotton. <clears throat> right. So, I think we have a, we, we, we did radishes, I think, already, right? So, let's do, what is it, one, two, three, three, is it nine? Nine spaces? Can we get nine of these? We'll, we'll get nine. There we go. You love to see it. New field guide unlocked. Sure, dude. Um, let's get onions. Same thing. Nine. There we go. Thank you. How much money we got? Twenty-five hundred. Okay. Spinach. Yeah, we'll get spinach. We'll get nine as well. There we go. Is it three by three or three by? You know what I'm talking about. Um, round onions. Oh, look at those. Let's go nine as well. <clears throat> I won't get the wheat. Trade proficiency leveled up. 
stamina has been increased. Oh, that's interesting. Huh. Very, very interesting indeed. Well, I guess we're gonna, I guess, talk with everybody. Right? I think that's a good idea. Talk with everybody, see how everybody's doing. Whoa. Look at this place. That's a massive chest you got there. That's a massive gem you got there as well, as well, as well, as well, as well, as well. Oh, look at her. Look at her. Look at her. Uh, no, 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 but you could go, 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 go back to sitting down and having the umbrella. That was adorable. Yeah. But for you, look at you. Yeah. Nice. Hello, new, uh, new people that I have never met. How are you? Muttering. Wow, look at that outfit. You are, uh... You woke up this morning and, uh... Uh, anyways, excuse me, is the boss here? Since I was a child, I have known to... I have known how to reject others. Dude, is she doing this? Are we doing this? What? She looks so shy. I have known how to reject others because the best way to protect my art is to reject others first. I haven't said anything yet. Every stone has a past. Even a rock that is rough now had a past when it was smooth. Can you two talk to me? Two? How could you see me? Uh... Isn't it normal to be able to see you? Are you a ghost? Is this some kind of prank? <laughs> Um, I don't know how to answer or ask this question. These are a lot of crazy questions asked on a first, like, first couple minute basis. Isn't it normal to be able to see you? I'm very sorry, but I didn't expect anyone to notice me so soon. I mean, you're out here in a maid outfit with, like, a leg garter, you know? Yeah, <laughs> because since I was a child, my presence has been weak. It's usually hard for anyone to notice me, especially when there are others around me. I'm really sorry for saying so much in one breath. In a moment like this, I should introduce myself. My name is Pauline. The person talking to himself here is my brother, uh, Poer. He is immersed in his own world of art. I see, okay. If the encounter between us is accidental, is the ending between us really inevitable? Inevitable? My lord. That's what my brother is like once he is in that state. It's hard to interrupt him at times. Uh, this is the creation workshop here. My big brother, Proer is, Proer, is responsible for building various facilities. And I sell furniture. Oh, okay. Well, I'm very sorry to tell you so much again. Uh, don't be sorry. As you can see, my brother can't operate in the state right now. Please come back later. So we have a f person that sells furniture in a maid outfit. Perfect art. Uh, don't you think so, Pauline? Pauline, uh, Pauline, where are you? <laughs> oh my god. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. Uh, interesting indeed. Alright, then we talk with Mr. Uh, Mr. Power, yeah? Hi. You task, farm construction management, urban construction management. Well, we won't get into that quite yet. One thing at a time here. And then, uh, Pauline, friendship increase. You, you can see me, right? Yeah, I, 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 I certainly can. You want hardwood. Okay. Interesting. Um, it is said that there is a profession called pop idols outside the town. If I also became become a pop idol, maybe everyone will notice me. Oh my lord. Let's look at the furniture store. She's what? I mean, you can't argue it. She's running an incredible deal. Everything is 1% off today. So that's awesome. Zari says, I have to work. Hope everyone has a great day. Have a great day too, Zari's, And thank you for the uh, gifted memberships as well. Do take care. Thanks for hang hanging out with us. So this is 1% off. So that means uh, a $50 log fence for being 1% off is still $50. <laughs> what an interesting sale. Log fence uh, set up. A fence made of logs can be installed on the farm. I wonder if you could do that for like... Uh, Corralling animals? Pavilion? That's a pavilion? Crafting table? That looks kind of cool. Mayonnaise maker? Cheese maker? Juicer? Brewer? Wool? Look at the brewing machine. Oh my lord. Sausage maker? Blender? 
my lord. All right, well, you got some interesting stuff here, lady. Uh, nice to have you. Who are you? Stop looking at me. I'm busy. Oh, my lord. Hello, Bruce. As a person who builds buildings, it is called mach it is called machine person. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> you need some coupons, my man? <laughs> I'm sorry, 1% off. Tuya, Tuya, uh, what do you mean you look down on red? Please don't make me repeat it. Just talking to you and breathing the air you breathe is a uh, desecration. Uh, de des desecration, desecration to fashion. Talking to someone who is nonsensical about fashion as you is like playing music to a cow. You have a rustic smell all over you. If I were your customer, I would be so ashamed of my choice that I would find a hole in the ground to hide in. My lord. They actually said asshole in this game. Uh, <laughs> asshole, <laughs> do you want to fight? What the heck is happening? Huh, what a savage. <laughs> the response? Some, if someone asked you that question, hey, do you want to fight? I don't think the answer to that question is, huh, what a savage. Why don't you take a look at yourself? Is your so-called fashion to dress up as a beetle? What the f A beetle? What nonsense are you talking- that- what nonsense are both of y'all talking about? Wait, someone's coming. Great, let- let her judge. Oh, Jesus. Don't put me in the- in the- in between the two of you. Lord have mercy. Hey, you're here just in time. My name is Tuya. I'm the tailor in town. I think red is unparalleled best color in the world. I'm sure you would agree, right? Don't listen to her nonsense. The essence of fashion is the collision and the compliments of different colors. My name is Kuro. I'm the hairstylist in town. In other words, I'm the hair designer. I have spent a long time studying in the city of arts. That's... That again, I have spent a long time studying in the city of arts. How many times do you have to repeat this? Tuya says. I'm just telling the truth. Did I hurt your feelings? Whatever, I don't care. I believe this passerby will make a wise judgment. Tell me, what do you think? Who looks better, me or him? Okay, so that is a him. Um. <laughs> I mean, you both look fabulous. <laughs> I, no one is as good as me. All right, well, I don't want to ruin your parade. Uh. And, you know, Redhead... I love th this new fighting game. Hails to you, Cans. <laughs> Thank you for the tip there. German Road Crew says, I love this new fighting game. <laughs> Appreciate the tip there. Oh my god, that was very kind. Thank you very much for that for that tip. $25 tip. That was very nice. Oh my god. Oh. No one is as good as me, dude. How dare you? Don't copy me, asshole. That's my words, you parrot. And stop calling me. If you want to be more fashionable, I can help you change your hairstyle. I promise to make you the focal point of the town. If you want new clothes, my skills won't let you down. I can finish what you want in, 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 in one day. I'll be real with you. I wasn't expecting them to actually put the A into the hole in this game. Uh, you can't even say A-hole. You can't even say asshole on TV. I was a little, I'm a little surprised by the choice of dialogue there. Interesting. Um, Y'all were too much for me. I'm gonna be honest with you. Y'all, like, were too much for me. I'm just gonna walk away. What time is it? I don't even know what time it is. It's 1300? Oh, yeah, yoy. I feel like I've lost, like, five years off my life in, in this, like, first, like, run down the road here. Anybody else want to, uh, talk about anything else? Anything else ridiculous? My lord. Where does the hair die in and the brain cells begin? <laughs> This is Heart. Hello, Heart. Hello, young person. Your town is out of control. You need to, like, set some laws in place. They're out there. They're, they're out of control. You need to do something about this. 
This must be some community board, board of commissions. Various and trust tasks will be refreshed in the bulletin board next to the guild. You can view them on your memo. Very well. Uh, we won't look into any right now. Who is this person? Hello? Check her clothes store? I definitely shall. Shouldn't I? Teg. I'm gonna call him Teg. Right? Hello, stranger. Uh, do you need help? I'm the priest here. My name is Teg. Give a self-introduction. Uh, you're the new guy on the farm. I guess we didn't really choose a gender, now did we? Nice to meet you. I heard Mayor Hart mentioned you. Now the town is short of people. I believe you should be able to make a big difference. Anyway, the town welcomes you. This is the temple of the goddess. The goddess will hear your voice. I pray for the goddess to bless you and make your wish come true. I, I, I appreciate that. Thank you. Uh, no more for me, though. Have a good day. <laughs> so far, everybody in this town scares the crap out of me. I feel like if I say the wrong thing, we're going to have like some sort of like, like Yu-Gi-Oh standoff or something. Where somebody's going to just pull out cards and we're going to just battle. Oh, that's Abby. Oh, no, dude, she's crazy. I'm walking away from her. I kind of do want to go to the clothes store, right? See what kind of outfits there are. Woo! Zion Dragon says, I finally caught you live. Evening, everyone. Evening to you. Zion Dragon, how you doing? Hopefully I said your name right. I love that he doesn't bother putting the wig back on. I know, right? He was like so like, so upset about it. So there's, okay, that's a fashion salon. So we don't want to, I mean, there's hairstyles, right? Let's, let's talk with the, with the fashion store. Yeah, let's do the store. Let's see here this first. Hello, redhead. Time is precious. Spit it out. My Lord. Goodness gracious. Hey, Sue Ann. How you doing, Sue Ann? Custom clothing. What do you mean custom clothing? Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Look at, look at, look at that outfit. That outfit is freaking everything is it not that is a wonder look look how that is adored that's awesome blacksmith suit yo <laughs> watch it out now sweet girl pink this will give everyone kind of an idea of what to expect if you haven't played this game yet or haven't or you're kind of like thinking, you know, I'm going to watch Cans play it and maybe purchase it later depending on how I like the game. You know, uh, you could definitely um, see the different goodness gracious uh, uh, clothing options in this game. <laughs> Freestyle. I love the color of that. You can buy it after your Facebook level with residents from the State of Freedom comes to friendly. Very well. <laughs> oh, that looks very gypsy, gypsy-esque, yeah? Nomad? Oh, look at that. The Desert Knights. These are kind of nice. These are cool outfits, yeah. Uh, why didn't my character change? This must be, I guess, the the guy outfits. Uh, thank you, but no thank you. Yeah, men's clothing. I got it, okay. I really like this, though. That little outfit's kind of nice. Jewelry, clothing, regular clothes, women's clothing made with linen, light, and soft, and very popular among commoners. Very well. <sighs> this has been a hell of a day. This is day one. I want to see the, um, the, the, the hairstylist now. <laughs> what do you got for me, buddy? Huh? What do you got for me? Hey, did you want to change into a more fashionable hairstyle? <laughs> we'll see about that. Hairstyle research? You gotta do research to get hair... Ha huh? Hair... I'm not paying money for hairstyle research. You do have to do research. You have to pay money to get the research done? This is highway robbery, dude. A thousand dollars? Well, I'll come back to you later. We gotta go plant some crops. That's what we need to do. 
Is there anybody else that would like to talk to us today? There's an entire residential area. There's a hospital in this game. There's a library. Oh, can I go there? Yeah, let's use a waypoint. Let's go to the library, right? The library. Usually, usually in these farming games, the li librarian, they um, typically are kind of like the most interesting characters, right? Did we talk to this person? I guess not. Here we go. Sakona. Hey, Sakona. What's the commission? I don't know. Self-introduction. Newcomers. They have nothing to do with me. All right. Very well. Uh, if you don't need me, leave quickly. Uh, wait. What's your name, though? Sakona. Okay. Well, I mean, what do you want me to do? Is she, you know, Walker. Hey, you. Who gave you permission to enter the blacksmith shop? It looks like you were kicked out by the goddess, too, right? I don't know what happened. Haven't, I haven't seen you before. You probably are not a member of the goddess support group. Oh, yeah, yeah, there's a support group in this town. According to the procedure, you have to become a member of the goddess support group first. And then wait in line for your turn to speak to the goddess. Look, I don't want to join your book club. Because the goddess doesn't look like... look. <laughs> because the goddess doesn't like being disturbed by others, generally only a few people a month can talk to the goddess. Very well. Then the confessed uh, gifts and love letters were thrown into the cooking station, and the conf confessors were driven out by the goddess. I don't know what you're talking about. That's dramatic? Well, after all, she is the unreachable goddess. Such indifference, such aloofness, and such a beauty can only be worthy of her title of goddess. The first time I saw her, I fell in love with her, the way she is. I couldn't even ask her name before I was kicked out. I didn't know her name until I joined the Goddess Support Club. The Goddess Support Club is filled with people like me. I think you could be one of us. You might as well join the Goddess Support Club first, starting from knowing the name of the goddess. I don't know the name of the goddess. I already know the name? This is a lie. I beg your pardon? It's impossible you already know the name of the goddess. Could it be that the goddess has favored you? This is impossible. Impossible, I say. <laughs> and then they do like the Scooby-Doo run. And they bump out of here. What the heck just happened, dude? Talk to Sakona to commission her to make new tools while the smithy is open. But you can only have more advanced tools when you have the corresponding lower level tools. Okay. Smithies of different levels can create tools of different levels. Talk to Pover from the construction house to upgrade the smithy uh, to unlock more advanced tools. I think I understand. I don't know. I really don't know. What the heck is that? That looks pretty cool. That looks like a bar. Restaurant? Let's go see what's going on in here, I guess. Moon Bay Restaurant. Okay, very well. Jacqueline says hello from Hong Kong. First time to join your live stream. I love to watch your channel. You make my day. Thank you so much. Well, Jacqueline, thank you very much for that kind words. I appreciate that. Shout out to you and shout out to Hong Kong, baby. What's going on? Good to see you. Good to see you. GU, little cutie over there. Come on. Come closer. Okay. All right. So the first welcoming person we have here. Don't worry. I'm not some random strange person. Well, technically you are. I have no idea who you are, lady. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. Don't ever call me that again. Uh, look back. Look. Look back like her. Give. Nah, dude. We give her the same pose back right at her. Um. <laughs> look, like Lori said, you are really an interesting one. Yo, this one is full of lust. You gotta keep your eye on her. By the way, my name is G.U. I'm the boss and chief chef of. Moonbay. Although Lori has told me you don't mind introducing yourself to me, do you, dear? Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Kenzella, what a good girl. <laughs> Somebody called me a guy back there, and now you just said I'm a good girl? What? I don't know. <laughs> come on, come on. This is my gift for you. Oh. You are really looking forward to it. Oh my god. It's just a grilled fish I made myself. How about it? Do you like it? I like it. <laughs> You're such a sweet child. Well, I have something to do. I'll play with you next time I have a chance. Huh? I'll play with you next time I have a chance? 
If you want to cook, I can lend you the furnace in my restaurant. <laughs> Goodbye, honey. Wow. Um, mixed signals there. Yeah. Mixed signals indeed. I don't know what... Was that foreplay? Did I just do foreplay? I don't know what just happened. How to use the cookware. Come interact with the stove to cook delicious food. You could use recipes over the stove to directly generate food, or you can interact with different cookware. Just add any ingredients you'd like to start cooking. When you use different ingredients in cookware to cook new dishes, you will unlock new recipes. Unlock new dishes can be directly cooked by using the recipes over the stove. Right. Have a great day. <laughs> Oi. What time is it? 1500 now? Holy crap. This, this day has been a long day, right? Let's be real. It's probably been the longest day in history. What is this place? The church florist? The church has its own florist? My lord. Emma Russ says, hey, I discovered you about a week ago from your weed shop series and I've been in binging it. I'm a big fan of the Sim Slash management games. I love what you go what you got going on. Hope you're well. Hope you're well too. Yeah, good to see you. How you doing? Welcome in, Emma e Emma Ra Emma Ra Emma Ra. How you doing? Good to see you. Now I know this is what's his face, but I want to actually check the immigrants directory. Go take me to the library. Take me to the library. Yeah. That conversation took so many turns. I agree. I need this game. Oh my god, the convos. <laughs> Let's go to the library. That's it right there, right? No? Yeah, that's it right there. Time to run and don't look back. She might grab you as you run out the freaking restaurant. Is she a dateable character? Is that what that is? You probably would have to assume, right? The library's weird too. Oh, look at her. She looks cute. When the prince kissed his lips as delicate as roses, a miracle happened. Talia, the sleeping princess, finally woke from her long nightmare. Actually, that was still white. That's all right. What a beautiful love. Leia. Leia? 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 Leia also wants to be kissed by the prince from her dream. Leia's prince is... You! You! Who are you? Could could it be that you, just now, you... Uh, did you hear it? It's, it's too embarrassing. Soon everyone will know that Freya is... Is a strange person who likes to hide in the house and talk to herself. Freya can't face anyone. <laughs> there is no other way, but... For Freya's sake, Freya has to copy what happens in books and make you disappear. I've seen the way... I've seen the way to hide the body in the book. What? Leia has nothing to fear. Leia is going to... Uh, door shut behind me? Oh no? Yeah, that's basically what I'm thinking too. Oops. Uh, Freya doesn't seem to have eaten for three days. Wait, what? I can't get up. Let me find something to eat. Help her up. Help her up. Woo. Don't take the opportunity to do bad things to Leia. Who is Leia? Is that you? Is that your... So, you just wanted to help Freya up? I'm sorry, Freya. Freya misjudged you. Who's Leia? Thank you. Thank you for helping Freya. Freya forgets things when reading. Is Freya your name? Freya, Freya. Freya, Freya. Leia's name is Freya. Leia is the owner of Leia Bookstore. Oh, okay. Right. If you have any books you want to read, just come to Freya. Don't tell others about what happened to Freya, please. And Freya, Freya can lend you my favorite book. Then, then Freya will go back to reading now. <coughs> okay, let's move on. What else do we have here? Jinville Station? I don't think that's something for us. Hot spring? Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm looking at that, partner. House of Mermaid? Dude, I want to go to the mermaid house. 
Lindy? I know it's very late, right? And I should be like planting my crops and all. I kind of want to go to the mermaid house. I want to go to the to the mermaid house. What time is it? 1700? It's getting late. My lord. I'm glad the music changed. We've been listening to that last song for like the last, uh, like, I don't know, hour? The same one on repeat? Ha, ah, sir. Ah, you startled me. I didn't expect anyone to appear on the Black Hill of the town. Wow. It's this late already? I've been enjoying the scenery on the Black Hill for too long. Who are you? And, uh, why are you here? And why is it who, uh, capitalized? Like, why is? <laughs> My name is Hasur. I'm an employee of Goo Goo Avery. Goo Goo Avery? Oops, Miss Becky told me that I shouldn't casually share my personal information with strangers. What should I do? I've said it now. I should calm down now. What everyone will do at this time is try to eliminate others' memory. Uh, this is a strange choice of yours. Quickly give self... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Quickly give uh, self-introduction. We'll do that. I see. You're the newcomer everyone talks about. So, in that case, I can re I can be regarded as your senior. Kenzella, let's get along in the future. Yeah, let's do that. Speaking of which, Miss Becky gave me some reading material about Black Hill. Uh, so that's I think that's supposed to be Black Hill, right? Not Back Hill. That might be a typo. When I started the job. But I'm not good with books and stuff. Since you work on the farm, maybe you will find them useful. I'll give them to you then. What do we get? Back Hill information? I thought it was Black Hill. Did she say Black Hill at first? Or is it Back Hill? What is happening here? All right, then. I have something else to do. So I got to go now. Bye-bye. Wow. Back Hill. Wait a sec. Did she say... Was there... Did I read it wrong? Was it always Back Hill? Maybe it was always, always Back Hill. Did I read it wrong? There's a possibility. There's a very, very good possibility that I did read it wrong. Interesting. <laughs> Treasury of Tombs. How you doing, Treasury of Tombs? How you, go how you doing? What's going on? Hope you're doing well. What's going on? I have no idea what's going on, but it's exciting. I'm right there with you. <laughs> Let me drink water. Let me drink water. What the heck is this? This is Princess the... I don't know. Is this a Pokemon? Looks like Kanzilla fits right in, right uh, fits right into the video for the vibe of this game. I I I I 100 100 agree. Hello. Uh, did I just walk into somebody's house? Look at these flowers, though. Can I pick them? I can. Flower petals. Nice. Okay. I guess we'll go like all the way around. I mean, it's getting late. We should probably think about, whoa. I didn't know there was a level up. Okay, run efficiency. I guess we'll go around and try to get back home as fast as we can. It's spring one. Wait a sec. Do you see that in the top right hand corner? What does that mean? Spring one of one. Catch, oh, I think year one. Catch fireflies. After 7 p.m. every day, fireflies gather on the wild bushes as long as fireflies are caught. They will surround you and illuminate you tonight. Oh, that's kind of sweet. Now, another thing that it says on the Steam page about this game is that they... It says on Steam that this game only has really content for, like, the first year, and that throughout the development process, they will add more content in the following years. But really, just expect to have year one content. Um, at least that's what it says on Steam. So, I, didn't, I don't think I mentioned that in the beginning of the stream today. This game looks interesting. 
My sheep is adorable. That sheep was adorable, wasn't it? Is there any NPCs over there? What is this? Mining area? Mine entrance? Hill of the Forgotten Flowers? Peak? Cactus? Hot Springs? Who are you? Oh, Jinville's Jinville Station. Jinville Station. We'll get rid of the library, yeah. Okay. How long is the game? Um, is as long as you want it to be. As far as story-wise, they're gonna be adding stuff like that and whatnot in the future. Uh, but as far as like how long you can farm and do all that, you can do that freely for probably as long as you want. Story-wise, I think it might be. A year worth of like the first year of stories kind of like I guess Coral Island was Oh, that's just uh, that's just a station station got it Okay, let's go to the hospital then maybe Hello young person. Yeah. Hello to you. Oh the nighttime music's kind of nice Oh, everybody has their own little house oh, no. Look you can see through the window Look at it, and see through the window someone's sleeping. I mean, it's very weird and creepy that I'm doing, but the fact that you can just see through their window is actually kind of cool. Okay, I don't, I won't overdo it. Wallace, you can go home if you want, lady. I'm kind of just chilling. Someone in the hospital? Hello? And this is not a 24 hour hospital? Got it? <laughs> I do like this. I do like this, uh, this music going on here. It's kind of nice. Go back and activate the station. Uh, don't you have to repair the station? You have to repair it? Oh, no, you just activate it. Okay, cool. All right, good idea. Go back and activate it. Yeah, yeah. I thought you had to repair all of them. So you just have to repair the first one then. Okay, I'll activate it. Loey, thank you for subscribing as well. Appreciate it. Thank you. There we go. Piggy Express activated. <clears throat> wonder if you can pass out in this game. That's a good uh, a good shout. Yeah, I wonder if you have to pass or if you can pass out in this game. Uh, I'll keep my eye out on those. Uh, uh, sir, are you okay? How did we get to the town mayor's house? Uh, because we walked here? Do you need help opening your door? That's his house? He's a windmill? Fireflies? Oh, look at that! Oh, you could have the fireflies hang out with you at night. How cool is that? That's pretty cool. Yeah. That's pretty cool. I like it. All right, let's head back to our to our farm. Um, hopefully we that lady scares the crap out of me. Um, hopefully we have enough time to plant the rest of the stuff that we have. Probably not though. But I'm glad that I like talked to everybody, saw everybody, met. Well, not, we didn't meet everybody. Everybody, you know, we met a lot of people, but not everybody. Everybody, but it was good to kind of like. I guess have faces with names, names with faces, and, and things like that. There we go. Let's go back. The graphics remind me a bit of Wildflowers. It's getting late already. It's time for me to go back. Well, that's fine. If it wasn't for work tomorrow, I would really want to accompany you for a longer walk. The town scenery at night is also very beautiful. Kenzella, tomorrow you will you will start your farm life on your own. Although I can't stay by your side, I will think of you and cheer for you. Well, thank you. I mean, what wonderful people! Maybe besides the hairstylist and the uh, hair and the hairstylist and the. Uh, and the blacksmith and the uh and the in the in the clothing person you know everybody seems okay ish i guess <laughs> everybody is dealing with their own stuff in this game i tell you who are you and why are you here excuse me 
Amanda? Amanda! I don't want to give Amanda, uh, flowers. Maybe I do. Maybe I don't. Cancel? I just want to talk to you. Yeah. Hey, Karen. How you doing, Karen? What's going on? Amanda. I've tried all kinds of methods, and it seems like this house is really impossible to repair. I feel sorry for this t house, which was one of the most classiest houses in this town. There's a suspicious man on the farm. What? What do you mean there's a suspicious man on the farm? I, I don't know about this. My character knows about this, but I don't, and I'm controlling the character. I'm not a suspicious person. Wait. Am I talking man? Her? What happened? I'm a person who does good deeds everywhere by helping people fix their houses. People call me Amanda, the fixer-upper. When then, whenever I see a house that is broken down, I go fix it up. And after it is fixed up, I let people, mainly the poor, live there for free. Unfortunately, this house is so damaged that it can't be fixed up. It's a pity that it has to be demolished instead of being used to house more people. I guess you are a new resident of the town, small house, or resident of the small house over there. Just a reminder, your house can be upgraded. Okay, thank you, Amanda. If you hand in the materials needed uh, by the sign, someone will help you upgrade your house. Well, I thought that was you, Amanda. The structure of your house is very solid, so you can upgrade it at ease. Okay, since this house can't be fixed, I shall leave and look for the next house to work on. Bye. All right, well, bye, Amanda. Very well. I can pick up the rocks, yeah? That's my stone, stone materials, yeah. Oh, we'll do this all in the morning time, I guess. Dude, I wish I could have this music all day. Did I activate this? Shall I activate this? I think this is already activated, right? Transport, yeah. I want that. I want the pig. I want the pig as a pet, dude. I want him to be my pet. Own your animals. Go to the Golden Ranch or Goo Goo Bird Avery to buy animals. To buy an animal, you need to have all the corresponding animal enclosures. All types of animal enclosures can be built by Architect Power under commission. When there are animals in your animal enclosures, you can press F to interact with them with the wooden sign in front of the animal enclosures to manage your animals and animal enclosures. Very well. Oh, so this must be my... Oh, yeah, 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 dude, that's the Finding Nemo thing. Even though that's supposed to be a Goo Goo Bird. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Uh, are these ready to harvest? Oh, the heart... Yeah, yeah, these we are ready to harvest. Okay, I should have probably done this, like, first and foremost, right? The music's very peaceful. I agree. I agree. Emily Peters, how you doing, Emily? What's going on? Hope you're doing well, Emily. It's got that Harvest Moon vibe. I miss Harvest Moon so much, dude. I do. So what happens if you read this book? It's too late. Please have a good rest. Thank you for saying please. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. It's midnight. I'm gonna test the waters, I think, a little bit and see how late I can go. I'm assuming maybe 2 a.m. I'll test the waters, I guess, like day one, test the waters, see how late we can stay up. Oh crap, dude, I bought so many seeds. No, I didn't, I, I'm fine. I bought enough seeds, Never mind. we're good. I thought I bought way too much. I like how they call it a kettle in this game. Okay, so is it 2 a.m.? Nope, okay. I thought I passed out there for a sec. There we go. It also looks like, yeah, rainbow. Looks like there's like a different variation of crops when you're growing, like there's a chance or something. Oh, she's tired. She is tired. Kenzella is tired. Let's go inside. Hurry, 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 hurry. Go inside, get inside, Kenzella. Go to sleep. All right, I'm not gonna test the waters. I got scared. That's our house. That's cute, I guess, right? Every, holy crap. Everybody just sent me an email. <laughs> uh, here we are. Profit from yesterday, nothing, because we did nothing. Everybody just sent me an email. Let's take a look at it. Oh crap, cutscene, dude. Who are you? Mod. Well, please, uh, please don't get too close to me. I'm a little nervous. Sir, you are at my house. 
I'm good, not good at this kind of stuff, like greeting strangers, etc. But Uncle Hart wants me to come in person. Say, it's basic cur courtesy. Okay, and who are you? Ah, I haven't introduced myself. So, my name is Maud. I'm the shipment collector in town. The things in the box at the entrance of the farm are what I take away every day. I mean, we can also be regarded as, you know, partners of the farm, right? I, I guess so. I'm looking forward to working with you, Hotna. Um... Ah, I almost forgot to tell you something important. Because people learn that you are here, uh, there are a lot more farm commissions from the town. Uncle Hart should have written them all down in the memo. You can open it at any time and check. When you are free, you can also go to the task board outside the guild. Some people will release the entrustment a week in advance. You can also deliver whatever the client needs to the commission board, but the client should prefer that you hand it over to them directly. And Becky of the Goo Goo House recently said she needed wheat for bird feed. If anyone brought her enough wheat, she would thank her with a old feed machine. Okay, so we need to talk to Becky. Anyway, that's all I have to say. If there's nothing else, I am leaving now. Okay, so talk to Becky, give Becky wheat and all that. Very good. All right, check my emails. What do we got? Heart. Oh, poor, my poor memory. If you want to mine by yourself, you can go to the rocky land on the farm to find Miner Croc and get a hammer. He has been working there recently. Do's letter. Who, who's do? Dear sir, are we a... What? <laughs> I don't know if we're a guy or a girl, dude. We might be anything at this point, but they're like very dropping us in different areas here. I've heard that you have settled down on the farm. I should have visited in person. However, I am too busy taking the challenge of the stone sword in the farm to visit you. Thanks for understanding. I don't know what you just said. Power's letter. I'm very sorry for what happened yesterday. I was too focused on building the perfect statue. Uh, so that I only learned about your visit later from my sister. I would like to... I would like you to accept this item as an apology. Five square street lamps? Or one? Did you give me five or did you give me one? What just happened? Kenzella, help me more often in the future. Keep in mind. Kid, remember to come back here to Back Hill often. Back Hill has not only... Is not... Back Hill has not only beautiful scenery, but also many good things. Don't forget. Thank you. Thank you for what happened yesterday. Leia has a lot of books to read. If you like reading, you can borrow books from Leia Bookstore, which she is reluctant to sell. Uh, welcome to Small Town. May the goddess bless you to, to realize your aspiration as soon as possible. My lord. Newspaper? Light rain? There will be light rain tomorrow? All right. Very well. Wow, what a, what a, what a, what a strange day it's been. Or a strange, like, couple days, I guess you could say. They don't know if I'm a guy or a girl. I know, I should feel offended. Like, I haven't, uh, no option has been given to me whether to, to classify myself or not. I don't know what the heck's going on. There we go. Unless, unless, you know, when we were in the clothing store, right? Unless when we were in the clothing store, you know how we saw, like, the guy's clothes and it changed our character model? I wonder if you can just switch between a guy and a girl at any given time? I don't know. Uh, yeah, we're very familiar with the, uh, with the well. We know how that works, so let's make that work. Yeah, I'm not really sure how that all works. Because, you know... I was like, wait, why did we switch to a guy when we put on the guy's clothes? I have no idea. But level up and plant proficiency. So we went from D to D plus. Love to see it. And we got a little bit of stamina up there too. Cool. All right. Oh, we also have this chair. Now we already have a chair inside our house. So I think it'd be ridiculous if we had another chair. What? What's the dressing mirror? Oh, is this where you change your outfits and stuff? That's kind of cool. Wait a sec. Did you see that? Right foot, left foot. Can you have two different shoes on? <laughs> That'd be kind of cool if you could have two different shoes on. Guess we'll place this uh, chair. Let's see how we place items in this game. Can we rotate? Yeah. Place that right there. Whoop. There we go. Cool. 
Uh, we need a pickaxe. That's what we need, isn't it? What the heck is up there, dude? Oh, is that a scythe? What is that? Ah, the sword in the stone. We'll see about that. <laughs> hey. I'm waiting for... I'm waiting for the remaster of Wonderful Life. Oh, yeah, me too. We're going to be playing that 100%. Don't, don't ever think I'm not, because I'm definitely going to be playing that. I'm excited for that. Hello? What are you doing in a tree? Why did you fall out of a tree? Do? <clears throat> uh, yeah, I cannot believe that your excellency uh, pulled out his the sickle. Uh, excuse me, what? Oh, it's a sickle. Well, the game told me it was a sword. Your Excellency must have heard of the legend of the sword in the stone. Well, you just told me it was a sword and now it's a sickle. What are you doing? Uh, didn't you just say sickle? That's what I'm saying. Hmm. Yes, this is a legendary sword in the stone. It is said that only the person selected by the goddess can become its master. It must be your ex Excellency. <clears throat> My name is Du. I'm the 99th generation brave warrior from the Brave Warrior Village. In order to save my companion, I'm playing the orchard owner here. To meet is fate. May I ask your name? I don't even know what my name is. Look, I don't even know what I am. I don't know who I am. I'm just, I just exist. So your ex excellency is Candela. What an amazing name. I thought so too. <laughs> Since I accidentally discovered the sword in the stone, I've been waiting for that special moment every day. Unexpectedly, I just uh, left for a little while. And your excellency, ex can you stop saying your excellency? I can't even say that word. You're hurting my, my mouth. Got to it first. It is already a great pleasure to see the weapon from the legend. It is also a great pleasure to be able to get to know your excellency, Kenzella. Two great pleasures intertwine. Uh, it should have produced more pleasure. But why am I feeling depressed now? I, your headband might be on too tight. Your excellency, Kenzella, I have a small request. Please test the power of this sword in the stone for me. In this way, I can leave no regrets. Regrets or regrets. All right, well, here we go. Sword in the stone when equipped with the sickle. Uh, press that to destroy the nearby weeds. Uh, sickles can also be used to harvest mature crops. Oh, very good. Uh, let's send it. Yeah, you like what you, what you see there? Look at me swing it, dude. Yeah, I got leaves. Dude, he just like... Naruto the hell out of here. Good for you. There we go. Awesome. So we got a sickle. That's wonderful. I, I want to get, um, we want to get a pickaxe now, I think, right? Yeah, pickaxe. Let's check the map. Yeah, right there. We got to go right there. Let's go talk to that person now. Oh, I love how it like actually, sh like, it's like a beam of light. Let's go. Excuse me, what death's mine? Excuse me? Hey, Tamika, how you doing, Tamika? Wait, it's ridiculous to have more than one chair in the house? It's ridiculous to have more than one chair in the house when your house is the size of a closet. <laughs> this is Croc? Yo, I actually uh, love your shoes. Are you here for that too? Do I have to spell it out? You also heard the woodcutter's rumor and came to blackmail me, didn't you? Dude, why is everybody paranoid in this town? As soon as people got close to me, uh, they would encounter misfortune. Some of them got knocked out by falling one or pieces. Some of them fell into random holes in the ground. I've seen a lot of people like you come in here to extort money from me in the name of medical expenses. I thought this was a place free from worldly strife, so I decided to spend the rest of my life here. Now I find that there are still too many opportunists uh, people around here. Dude, these people talk way too much. They get themselves in trouble. <laughs> they get themselves in tr trouble. Hold up, sir. They're self-incriminating themselves everywhere. Now what? I told you so much of kindness about kindness, uh, but, but don't you think you can get close to me? D don't think you can get close to me now. We will introduce ourselves. So it's you. I judged too fast. I apologize. My name is Croc. I'm a miner in town. 
The mayor mentioned you to me. He told me to give you the, this hammer. You can use it to mine. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate it, Croc. You can also go to the death mine in the town and entrust me with mining. This is my job, and I won't refuse. Okay. If there's anything else, I'm leaving now. All right. Goodbye. So when approaching the ore, hit that with that and do that with that, and then it goes like that. Good. Good job. Very well. So we have the hammer now. Nice. This looks like there's a quest over here. Move stuff? Buddy's favorite food? A simple recipe? Okay, there's a lot of different things happening. A lot of different things happening. Now, one thing is certain is we definitely want to get, like, stone, right? We want to get stone and we want to get uh, wood to fix the uh, Piggy Express, right? That's a little bit of work. Now, wait a sec. I don't know how inventory works in this game. They really didn't say anything about inventory. Is it unlimited, I wonder? Or if there's gonna be like some sort of capacity. That's a big, that's a big inventory. Um, that's a big backpack <laughs> right there. <laughs> hey, play with Moxie. How you doing, Moxie? What's going on? Can I pop that? Yeah, dude, I could pop that any day I want. Yeah, all right. Cool. What the heck is that? What is that? Sacrifice? It doesn't seem this item is needed. Oh, it needs a, uh, what is that? Like a, uh, a beet, a radish, maybe, yeah? A radish? Okay, cool. Now it's get, now it gets interesting. Cans and Crocs means funny stream moments. <laughs> I've been waiting years for the wonderful life. Had so much playing in, on the GameCube. Yeah, you know, in the Wonderful Life game, that's going to be a really fun... It comes out, like, I think this summer, right? June, uh, May, June, July, in that in that area, right? It's going to be a good time because um, that's one of those Harvest Moon games that I never got to play, so... Uh, you, well, you know what I mean. Um, one of those... You say GameCube, right? It came out on the GameCube. This was, I, I never owned a GameCube, so, like, this will be, like, one of the first times I get to play a Wonderful Life. So my first time going in... Uh, into Wonderful Life, uh, it's I, I, I'm just kind of I'm really excited about it. Let's see here. Can we do anything with that? So wait, we hit it. You need a higher level hammer to destroy that object. Okay, very well. So this is the piggy, piggy corral. Do you fix this? Yeah, you fix that. Yeah. Okay, that needs logs, fences. I see. Okay, I understand now. And then this takes the, um, the Finding Nemo's. Got it. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. All right. Love it. <clears throat> Hang on a sec. Let me, like... Yeah, it came out on GameCube and PS2. I had a PS2, but I didn't play Wonderful Life. I never had a GameCube, though. Even though some of the- some gr some great games were on, uh, were on GameCube for sure, right? Hello. How are you? Uh, let's- oh, oh, we need to talk to her. Wait a sec. Are you still doing about the quest, yeah? You're still doing about the quest. I guess we talk to everybody and kind of, like, give them, you know, Hi, how are you? Friendship points and all that, right? Um, I do want to talk to Becky, though, right? We got to talk to Becky. Hello. Friendship point? Yeah. Ah, so happy. So happy. Now, did your discount change? No? You're still charging 50 for this log fence. Now, is it log fence as in, like, you get the entire circle or you just get the entire square or do you get just one fence? I'm assuming you get the entire square. Yeah, we got to get to, we got to talk to Becky, dude. Where's Becky at? Brave Warriors Orchard, Garden Fair, Golden Ranch, Goo Goo Bird. Oh yeah, she's at Goo Goo Bird. All right, let's go that way. Let's go that direction, shall we? We couldn't figure out what that emblem was. It looked like a some sort of crop, right? Like you just like maybe put a sa you sacrifice a crop on there or something. Oh my God, look at them. Oh, yeah. oh, babe, look at that. 
Look at that little squirt. Oh, look at him on his side. That's Stella. That pig is called Stella. It acts like Stella. It's now named Stella. There's a green pig. There's a blue pig. Excuse me. Why do you have uh, the bubbles on your head? <laughs> Holy crap. Excuse me. I need to talk with this person. Ah. Road. All right. Little number 13. It's your, ne your turn next. You should, you sound happy. I guess you can't wait to hear my music. Then I will stop, wait. And I smell something special. There can be no mistake, the smell must be. How rude. Damn right. This is the smell of a distinguished guest. Oh, my nose never makes mistakes, guest. You have an extraordinary aurora. Aurora, 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 perfume. No wonder my number one cow produced a bottle of sweet berry milk this morning. <laughs> what? This must be a heaven inspired act to welcome you, my dear customer. Customer, this is a very rare, rare milk, but in order to celebrate our meeting, I am willing to give up my love. What do you think of this? As long as 500 gold, I will transfer it to you. What are you talking about? How about we, uh, give our introduction here? Huh? Oh! You are the new farm man! Mentioned by heart! He specially asked- He specially asked me to take good care of you. How about this? I'm willing to make another concession. I'll sell you this bottle of milk at the price of $4.99. Uh, no thank you. What a pity, dear customer. If you change your mind, you can come back to me at the ranch. Customer, meeting is fate. Let's take this opportunity to deepen our understanding of each other. My name is Rode, Cody Rhodes to be exact. I'm an honest businessman. In addition to operating this golden ranch, I sell some special products at the weekend market. If you are interested, you can come and have a look at Saturday and Sunday afternoon. I'm willing to give a special price to a special person. Very well. Yo, is that Becky? Are you Becky? You got a bird on your head, Becky. It is Becky. Goo, I haven't seen you. You're new in town, Goo. Goo. Goo? Don't tell Goo that you think the girl under Goo is the one talking. Do you, Goo? I don't know what you just said. Let Goo make this clear first. Goo is the actual one speaking. Actual one speaking? Look up, Goo. Goo keeps flapping his wings and talking. Can't you see Goo? Don't let Goo explain this every time. Goo meets a new person, Goo. Same thing happened to the new girl, Goo, record recruited before. Goo is so tired of this, Goo. Are you okay, Goo? Goo's name is not Goo. Goo's name is Becky. Goo is the owner of this Goo Goo Avery. Goo's so angry. It's like talking to the fool who calls himself the brave warrior all over again, Goo. No. Goo don't want to be a member of a brave warrior fellowship, Goo. Seems to be in a frenzy. I better leave. I better leave for other reasons, too. Let's be real here. All right, well, uh, Becky, I have uh, wheat for you. Hello, Becky. Uh, birdhouse store. Pink goo. Goo goo. Goo goo. Gaga. All right. Maybe I have to put it in the... In the... Is this your house? <laughs> Do I have to... Uh... Okay, hang on. Let, let, let's let's take a tea up. Let's take a tea up. Memo. Please help Lori. Okay. Contracts. Submit. Purchase ore. We can submit that? Oh, to Poer? Okay. I thought we said something about giving wheat to, to Becky. 
Radio Goo Goo. <laughs> hey Amanda, how you doing? Hey LJ, how you doing? What's going on? Did we not like he told us, right? He told us Becky needed wheat, right? I got the wheat for you, Becky. Let's read this book though. Reading will consume game time. Do you want to read? Sure. Backhill information. Backhill information finished. There are abundant resources in the backhill of the town. You can find rare materials, trees, and wild animals. You can also see a large backhill lake where you can fish. However, please be careful of the fisherman who lives by the lake. He is a strange man. Level up. Collect proficiency. Stamina up as well. Well then, that's good news, I guess. She doesn't need it yet, but when you get the quest, she will want 20. Okay, she would want 20. Okay, that's a good shout. 20. Is there anybody else down here that I haven't met? What do we have here? Garden Fair, in construction, or Town South Station. I guess we can at least activate that. What the heck, dude? That's a big guy. They're building something out here. Maybe we can... Oh, this is damage? Oh, frick. Uh, excuse me. Hi. Richard. <laughs> Everybody's got some crazy name, and then there's Richard. There's always a Richard, I guess. Hello, my name. <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny. May I ask if you are happy? No, Richard, you may not ask me if I'm happy. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Richard, for the time. Appreciate it, buddy. Have a good day. God. Of course, there's always a Richard, isn't there? Ay, ay, ay. <sighs> now, you said there's a Lindy, yeah? Am I missing a Lindy? Who's Lindy? There's a few people out of town? Gardener? There's a sheriff in this game? Yo, uh... Lock me up and throw away the keys. Lori... Oh, the doctor. The nurse and the doctor. Okay, we haven't gone there. Well, we have gone there. They just weren't in, uh, weren't in town yet. So maybe we can go there. Um, okay. So we'll go there, and maybe we can try to use the, uh, the fast travel. Now, actually, one thing that's actually kind of interesting. Construction zone. There's multiple construction zones inside of the town. I wonder if you can build uh, different buildings and stuff. Nice. Okay. Very well. Oh, by the mermaid place? That's where Lindy is? Is it like the cactus forest or like the hot springs? Or the destiny crossings? House of the mermaid? Oh, house of the mermaid. You can commission Lindy, the owner here, to go fishing. Sometimes he can find rare fish. Business hours, 1300 to 1900. Days off, Thursdays and Sundays. Okay. Got it. Lindy. Lindy. Let's go to the hospital and see these people real quick. Man, the day goes by so fast. Maybe I'm just having fun. I don't know. It could be that, too. I am having a good time. Even with the translation and the ridiculous dialogue, I, it's, I'm still having a good time. I think the gameplay is there. I think the story and, and all the other things is a little bit... Uh, you know, questionable, but... That's stuff that can be ironed out easily. Wow, look at you. Liv. So, you invited the girl from the neighboring town all the way here, and all you treated her to eat is a bowl of clear broth noodles, and she didn't even eat the broth because she didn't do the backwash? I shared my favorite food with her, which is the proof of our relationship evolving from doctor-patient relationship to friendship. <laughs> you be careful, you're gonna get yourself into a lawsuit. But why was she so upset? If I were her, I wouldn't be able to stand brother's 
stupidity either. You don't understand a girl's heart at all. How could you take a girl to the restaurant and only have a clear broth noodles? You should at least add two. No, ten spoons of hot sauce. Wait. He took her to the restaurant and she only got clear broth and noodles? Why didn't she order something else off the menu? Uh, huh? As long as there are hot peppers, no matter what you eat, it will be very delicious. What the hell are they talking about? Wait, someone's coming. It's a face I haven't seen. Could it be the newcomer to the farm? It doesn't matter who it is. Brother, let him, again with the him, tell you how serious a problem is to invite people to dinner without hot peppers. No matter what, it's unhealthy to eat like this, but I still want to hear your opinion. It's not about hot peppers at all. Hot peppers, the source of life. Are you guys inviting me to dinner? Are you guys inviting me to dinner? <gasps> Could this be an invitation for me and my brother? It's work hours. If you want to invite us, at least wait after until after work. Since you here, since you are here at the hospital, do you feel any discomfort? A little bit. My head hurts. I'm the doctor of the town. Usually, everyone just calls me Juan. Uh, you can trust me for your health care. I'm, ha I'm Han's uh, younger sister, Liv. I'm also the nurse in this hospital. It's my duty to take care of every patient on behalf of my brother. When you feel sick, make sure to come and see us. Don't wait until you faint and have to be carried here. After all, Liv hates, hates to see people getting sick. Very well. You guys are interesting folks. So let's use this Piggy Express, shall we? How far can we actually use it? Hospital station, I guess for the places that we've gone to. We can actually take it back home. Let's do that. Let's do that. Have a good one, Auntie Meow. Do take care. Thanks for hanging out with us. Oh, uh, oh, it's 5 p.m., huh? Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. I have nothing for you. But I do, and I will... Uh, pick up a few things around because I do need to actually rebuild that thing We should probably focus on that quest that uh, piggy express quest. Yeah, so we'll get some wood. We'll get some more stone We'll kind of harvest a little bit. What the heck is this? I, did, I don't want to pick that up. No that, that, That's a barrel There we go. I wonder if you could expand your house out like there's a lot of land back here, too Huh a lot of questions I have for this game There we go I should probably like have more uh, uh, garden plots as well. Hey Lizzie, how you doing Lizzie? What's going on? Good to see you, welcome in. You've missed an incredible ride so far. <laughs> an incredible two hours of, I don't know what the hell's going on. A lot of crazy, spicy, weird dialogue also, but uh, Having a lot of fun, nonetheless. Might as well do a little bit of this work that we got, that we need to do. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Uh, I honestly wasn't thinking of like, I, I did not think coming into this game today that I was going to be laughing as much as I have today. It has made me laugh a bit. Always good to laugh. It always feels good to laugh. Puts a smile on your face. Relieves stress, right? All that good stuff. All right. <clears throat> I'm not going to be picking up any ores right now. I don't think we need to really pick up any ores. Not until we have a definitive, like, goal. As far as, like, wanting to, um... Expand on our, on our farm plots. I don't know exactly a good place. Maybe in the back here we could have another farm plot back there. Maybe I could do something like that. I guess technically, whoops, I guess technically you can kind of just start anywhere you want. Maybe we do that. Maybe we'll dig out a couple of things in the back. Let's see here. Change to, uh, hoe. Uh, excuse me, hoe? Thank you. Oh, no, no, no. So you have to have these actual plots uh, in order to do that, right? Oh, unless... Okay, you can't actually do it in the back. Okay, okay, okay. I see. Never mind. Okay, I, I understand now. So, yeah, you can't do it in the back because obviously your house probably gets that big or gets bigger to that point. I see. Okay. So then maybe I can clear out this area and kind of get something uh, started over here. There we go. Like that. 
Like this. Can we knock out this tree? Shake it first. Shake it like a salt shaker. Uh, you did pretty good, yeah. Oh, holy crap. Oh my lord. That was a lot. Okay, there we go. Get the simple hammer out. Just kind of pop it. Pokey Master Brown says, I subscribed after your Dinkum game. Well, I appreciate that. Thank you. How you doing? What's going on? Thank you for subscribing after checking out the Dinkum. The freaking Dinkum is a good good game, for sure. I need proficiency has gone up a bit. That's nice. There we go. Yeah, so I think in the morrow, I'm going to kind of just like put some props down here and just kind of lay them out so we can get this stuff growing quickly, quickly, quickly. I mean, I guess we have time now. It's only 2100. Can I find a firefly? Oh, the music at night is so good. I'm looking for bushes around because you have to get them at the bushes. Right? By the way, if you're watching this and you want to see more of uh, Song of the Prairie, please make sure to hit the like button. Uh, that tells me you want to see more of this game in the future on the channel. There's no other fireflies. I don't see any. Okay, we're going to work in the dark then. So I want to do uh, nine spots, nine places, yeah. Um, not going to really make it look pretty. I'm just going to kind of send it right now. Just so we can get this stuff up and going. There we go. A three by three, yeah. Here we are. And there. And then hit me with this. Perfect. And then let's make sure we... Before we start planting a bunch of stuff, we got to make sure we can kind of... Get this going because we, our stamina is getting really low. Cool. Oh. Oh no, don't get, don't get, don't get tired. It's okay. You're okay, Kanzella. I missed the beginning of the stream. Can you choose your gender in this game? I don't think so. I'm really not sure what they're going for with the whole, uh, I, I don't think there is a, a, a gender specific they do call you by him and her um but there is two different kinds of characters actually i mean they they call guy i mean they call i don't know it's it's a it's a very confusing thing because they have what they describe as girl clothes and guy clothes but you don't get to i mean you get to choose your different characters yeah you can choose a guy character or a girl character but they all have different uh, special skills and things like that too it's a it's it's very kind of confusing is what really what it boils down I assume, I guess, I, I, you know, I don't know, but the dialogue won't uh, really do justice for you. There we go. Guess we'll place that for right there for now. Oh, he did give me five. Okay, so he did give me five of these street posts. Nice. Okay. You know what? Then um, I'm gonna go ahead and actually, let's see. Can I take this? I'd like to pop this. How do I get get the, uh, pick it up? Maybe empty hand. I don't want to sit on it. Maybe I pop it. Pop it. Don't destroy it. Please don't destroy it. It's probably going to destroy it, isn't it? I don't know. I don't know how to... <laughs> I don't know how to pick up items. I don't know how to pick up... Uh, uh, furniture. I don't know. I have no idea. But I would like to put a light post there. That's the idea. This is our house, by the way. I'm really interested because I wonder if there's different kinds of things because this suggests that you can have uh, different um, pieces of clothing, which, by the way, I want to put like two different shoes on just because and see how that works. That is considered a backpack. That little light on us is considered a backpack. I'm really interested to see all this uh, customization for your character and all that. Damn. Let's go to bed. Got a couple more emails. Nice. What are your thoughts so far in the game? I think it's good. Yeah, I think the gameplay so far is fun. I'm enjoying it. Um, the world looks cool. I, I can't really like give a definitive answer on my complete thoughts. After all, it is early access, so there's so much missing from it anyways. Uh, the dialogue is easily can be ironed out. There is a little bit of translation issues, but it that's not that big of a deal, really. It's comical, if anything. Um, but yeah, I'm having a good time so far. Yeah. 
I think the fact that the game is complete full controller support in early access is, is a good sign as well. Good morning, I found a letter at the door of your house and picked it up for you without authorization. I'm telling you, these people tell... They self-incriminate themselves in this village, town. What the heck? Who says that? No name on it. Who could it be from? Open it and take a look. Well, I'm glad you didn't open my, my, my mail. That's a federal crime. <laughs> Come and see me in the back hill. I'm ready for our fateful appointment, says question mark. Ah, harassment letter, love letter. You know this person? He's an old acquaintance. Uh, alas, a troublemaker, actually. I don't want to gossip behind people. What's more, I don't want my personal feelings to affect your understanding of someone. You better get to know them yourself. This letter was written by Lindy, a fisherman in the town who opened a mermaid home back at the Back Hill Lake. If you are interested in fishing, you can ask him for advice. At least in this case, he is reliable. Moreover, based on my understanding of him, he should have prepared a small gift for the newcomer. Okay, very well. There's a sheriff in town, report her facts. Uh, email. It actually says email? Oh my god! <laughs> I was just making a joke. I didn't actually think it was email. I thought it were they were like letters. That was an unintentional joke that actually was true. So I guess it is emails in my mailbox. Anyway, uh, Liv insisted that I should write to remind you to take care of which I think might not be necessary. You will not be able to work if your body breaks down, so please take good care of yourself. If you feel any discomfort, you should go to the hospital immediately. Dear customer, we have established a good early stage relationship as an excellent businessman in the town. I look forward to pleasant cooperations between us in the future. Uh, unexpectedly, you pulled out the sword and the stone. It seems that you got the ability to become my partner. These apples are the proof that I admire your ability, but I won't lose again, for I am a brave man. Thank you for the three apples there, do. Appreciate it, buddy. So it's raining, so that's good news for us. I mean, that just means that we don't have to water our plants, right? I honestly did not know they were that they were calling it. Um, I honestly didn't know they were calling it email. I'm a little shook. I will be real with you. Uh, Guild station. Let's go to there so we want to go see the fisherman that's first and foremost i guess yeah time to meet spicy lindy i'm scared i'm scared did i go this way yeah oh hey kitten how you doing have you spoke to lori yet you get a tool to move furniture with oh maybe not that's a good that's a good shout maybe i haven't talked to lori about the furniture moving thing i can't remember what who lori might look like or who they are is that an ice cube what the hell is this that's a crystal chair all right whoever this person is is bad and bougie oh i'm so sorry i uh, don't get close to me yeah my bad i apologize that was very rude of me Whoops. Maybe you should lock your door. This isn't Canada. My lord. Hey, Toasty, how you doing, Toasty? Oh. Who's running down the road here? Is this Lindy? This must be Lindy. <clears throat> hey, McSqueeze, how you doing? You saw the end of the change? Glad it was another win run. Can't wait to see the true ending next time. Me too. I can't wait to see the true ending as well. Can I take this? Pet? No! What the heck? <laughs> Adopt wild animals. What? Sometimes you will encounter wild animals in the field. You can press the R key to pick the animal up. When the corresponding animal enclosure in the farm has enough space, you can carry the animal into the corresponding enclosure. You could actually adopt wild animals? That's actually pretty cool. I don't know if there's a farming game out there that where you could just adopt wild animals. Not that I can think of off the top of my head. Dude, I want this. What the heck is... <laughs> what is that? Yeah... I want this. I'm doing good as well, Toasty, yeah. That means I can adopt, no, maybe I can't adopt that. I just dropped the bird on the ground. 
Hey, Mel, how you doing, Mel? In your life, there should be at least once when you lose yourself for a person. Not for results, not for traveling together, not for possession, not even for being loved back. Only for in the most beautiful years. To meet you. Here you are, my sweetheart. My name is Lindy, the only fisherman in town. I've been tossing and turning since I heard about you, and I can't wait to meet you. I specially prepared a fishing rod for you, which is full of my love and expectation. I spe- Okay, very well. What's the matter, sweetheart? Why are you so silent? I see. You must be so moved by this surprise that you can't speak. What are you talking about? Oh, I was, uh, negligent. It's windy by the wind, or by the lake. Sweetheart, uh, be careful not to catch a cold. If you fall ill accidentally, you will give me a chance to get close to you. Back off, I got mace. By the way, I will hold a fishing festival here on the 20th of this month. I hope you can attend it. I can think you're here for me, right? We will fish together in the sunset. Your side face reflected in the lake will be the most beautiful scenery of that day. When approaching the water, press the fishing rod and then press the corresponding keys according to the prompt to the fish. Very well. Let's try it out. Let's try fishing in this game, right? Night blue star. Ah, no, 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 don't touch me. Uh uh. You take your flowers elsewhere right now, my good man. Right? They said it was a he. He's a he, right? That's right. They said Lindy was a he. So you stand over there, young man. I don't know where I'm standing. Don't look at me as I do this. Do I just go for it? Is it a full send moment? I guess so. Oh. This fish seems strong. Okay. I don't know what I just did, but I did it. Small yellow tail catfish. How you like that? I go again. Can I go for the yellow one? I want the yellow one, dude. No, dude, I want the yellow one. Yeah. Oh. That's a big mama. Huge catfish, you think? I'm the greatest of all time. Didn't you know that, Lindy? That's a big boy. Whew. There was an option to call the police. Maybe you should have taken that one. Facts. <laughs> uh, who are you? Oh, I like your outfit. Bosu. Hmm. How should I repair this? Uh, first, let me do this. I love the... I love the dot, 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 comma. Then this and this. Dot, 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 comma. And then... Oops. Seems like the station is getting even more broken. Anyway, let me put the wooden pieces back together and pretend that nothing happened. You gotta love the dot, 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 comma. <laughs> No, 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 I didn't break it. As long as you take the initiative, I don't see anything. What? What do you have in mind for me to do? Let me make it clear. I only sell my body. No, I only sell my service, not my body. Good recovery. Rob, you, of course. I'm joking. Boy, you have no ta talent. I'm JKing you all the way. People in... Your town are so terrible at telling jokes, and the boss always likes to make some terrible jokes with me, such as deducting all my wages. Such such as deducting all my wages. But I really didn't break this. Sigh. You actually said the word sigh? It's all because boss is so stingy that I had to run on foot from the ranch to back hill every day, which led me to try to fix this bus stop. Bus stop? You mean Piggy Express? As a result. There's buses in this world? You're a ranch employee? Yes, you see, I'm dressed so down. 
I'm obviously dripped out in swag. I'm working for the right profiteer. My name is Sumu. And you? Wait, what? Your name is Su Mo? Or is it Mo Su? What is your name? It's Kanzella. That, that name sounds familiar. My friend with the familiar name. I will see you next time. Otherwise, boss will say I'm lazy and deduct all my salary this month. Sumo, sum. Dude, you effed my head right there. This bus station seems to be out of service. They call it a bus station? I thought it was like the Piggy Express, dude. Don't even talk to me, Becky. Becky. Oh, this isn't Becky. It's Hasur. Hasur. Wait, 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 hey, 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 hey. Have I talked to you yet? Lady, come here. Come here. How dare you run away from me. <sighs> for me, the fishing can make a break a game. One of my favorite activities is fishing in these farming games. I, yeah, fishing is... I think fishing... When it comes to farming games, for sure, fishing is like one of the most important aspects of the game. I, I, I believe that too. Well, there are people that say LOL instead of laughing, so... <laughs> Yo, I just LO with L. Some lands say the fam some lands say their family name first when introducing themselves. So but that nobody has any family names in this game, right? At least I don't I don't I haven't seen any. Let's see, hang on. Right? I don't think... I mean, everybody just has, like, a first name, right? Unless he's different. Of course. Maybe, right? Possibly. Oh. Okay. There's a lot of different relationships going on there. My lord. He might be different. Hey, Waffle, how you doing? She was offended because you called her the wrong name? Wait, Mosu was... I'm so confused. Sumo Mosu? Ay, ay, ay. I'm, my head is in a thousand places right now. Activate. <laughs> By the way, hello, Hannah. How you doing, Hannah? What's going on? All right, so like task number one is to repair. What the heck are you doing? Is to repair the Piggy Express. Um, hello, mod. Hello, mod. Yeah, so let's go repair repair that Piggy Express first and foremost. We've been kind of um putting it off, so to speak. Activate. No, that's a transport. We've already activated that. Wheat for bird feed. That, yeah, that's exactly what I thought we were supposed to do, right? That's why I came out here yesterday, dude. Because we had the wheat for the bird feed, right? Or the machine. Look here, Goo Goo Gaga. Freaking Lady Gaga. Lady Goo Goo. Let me talk to you, Becky. See, I always had trouble with Beckys. View tasks. Mission. Oh, there's the 20. Okay, so there's the 20 all together. All right, 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 I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, okay, okay. 20 wheat. So let's kind of focus on getting 20 wheat, I guess. Yeah? I guess so. We'll go to the... I don't want to open because this is my general store shop place. I actually want to go here one more time. The fashion store. Time is precious. Spit it out. Jesus. Why are people so mean? Now, again, I wonder if this would be like the only place, by the way, I, I again, I think this outfit is absolutely adorable. I wonder if this will be the only outfit place or place that you could get uh, items for your character or if there will be other places 
like uh, backpacks and other items like that. I guess that's considered a backpack right there, right? But this is what I'm talking about. So the guide clothes changes the entire clothing items of the opposite sex cannot be worn after purchase. Wait, what? Clothing items of the opposite sex cannot be worn after purchase. So why would you give me the ability to buy it if that's the case? Just don't give me the option to buy it. Plain and simple, right? It's not that hard. I'm not crazy, you're crazy. <laughs> I'm not crazy. You're crazy. Oh, we need to talk to Lori, too. Where's Lori? Lori. Lori's right there. Lori! Lori? Where the hell is Lori? Are you right here? Take me to Lori. Pauline and Poer have c completed quests. Hello? It is said that there is a profession called Pop Idols. Okay, yeah, we've talked about that lady. Hard wood. Okay, we ha we can give you the hard wood. No problem. Submit. Lori is maybe here? Lori, are you in here? Where is Lori? Lori? Or is Lori right there? I, the Lori's right there, right? Yeah, right there. That's Lori. No. That's do. You know what? I have actually something for you, though, Power. Art is the true essence of the world. You want copper ore? There you go, buddy. I don't even remember picking up these quests. I'll be real with you. This isn't Lori, is it? No, you're not Lori. You're Bruce. That's Lori, right? No, that's not Lori. That's Croc. Lori, you're the uh, happy do nothing lady. Okay, very good. So sleepy, you choose what you want. Lori with the piggy express, got it. Okay, we got it, girl. I got you. Don't worry, Lori. I'm right there with you. Yep. Repair that bad boy. Is that Bruce? Bruce hit him. There you go. Okay, we got it. Whew. Uh, Bruce. How long is this gonna take, buddy? Like, I want this done, like, right now. You understand me? Right now. Yeah. Right now. Lori! We did it. I well, I guess not. I guess it's not completed quite yet. But it's it's in progress. In process, right? In progress. It's in. It's getting done. Okay. Grocery store. Let me have. Oh, you have a discount for us. I love the one percent off discount. It's truly incredible. I love the fact that I can get sixty. Uh, you know, I could buy a cabbage seed for sixty dollars, but you know, one percent off, I get it for sixty dollars. So that's really good, right? That's a good deal. I'm gonna need. How many do I have? Nine? I'm gonna need 11? We'll do another nine, I guess. We'll do two plots of nine. Yeah. Have a good day. That's a fantastic deal. That's Walmart pricing right there. Instead of $60, you get it for $60. Exactly. No way, it's $59.99 plus tax, so $60. <laughs> they get you in that tax. This person didn't want to talk to us last time. I will never stop fishing until I beat that Lindy. All right. Very well. Sounds, uh... Sounds good. I guess sounds good to me. What's over there? Wooden bridge, farm ruins, farm south station, the spring of the goddess light. I'm scared of the goddess, I'll be real with you. I ain't ready for that action yet, dude. All right, let's plant some things, shall we? Let's do it. Let's make a little bit of, yeah, let's grab the hoe out. No, grab the hoe. One, two, I could have separated, I really could have. But I decided not to for more space efficiency, obvious. And then let's throw down... Well, we're going to do everything, so... 
Yeah, we'll just go ahead and sew that in. Thank you. That should be watered by the rain. Now let's grab a hammer out. So the only thing we're really missing, I think, now is the remodeling hammer. And then, yeah, the remodeling hammer. I think that's what we're missing, which we, we will get that from... Uh, we should get it from Lori, right? After we're done with that quest. That's probably what it is. Oh. I like that sound. Ooh. <clears throat> I've seen some Im images online of stores with a higher price saying you're still saving. You collect those nine turnips that were already growing by the pond? Um, turnips by the pond. By the pond. I don't remember that. By the pond. By the pond. Oh, I see. I have not. Good shout. Uh, look at this. A wild bird. A wild goo goo. So I'm going to try to adopt this wild animal too. White radish. Animal following. Animals in the wild and at home can be touched. After touching, the small animal will follow you until you touch the next small, small animal or the next day coming. You know, you could use maybe the word pet instead of touch, or, you know, it's fine. Uh, I, trust me, I'm, I am in no position to tell anybody how to tell, you know, to, to put words on a piece of paper. I'll, I'll be real with you. I'm not your guy. You don't want me. No, you don't want me. So then we just slap him in here and say, this is your new home. Is it really adopting or is it kidnapping? This is a goo goo bird. What are you talking about? Did you see that? There is a censored word in the name? You're wrong. Hey! I would expect that. I would expect that. No spacing? What do you mean there's no spacing? Feed the feed for the goo goo bird. Okay. So demand for food, number of animals. It looks like they eat leaves, right? Feeding one goo goo bird equals 40 leaves. Is that what that is? Pet the goo goo bird. No, dude, this is finding Nemo. You need feed for this, right? That says, like, maybe that's something else. Maybe that's so that, that's something else. That's not leaves. You're not feeding the the, the chicken leaves. We need to get goo goo feed food bird bat. Yes. Yeah, that's what we need. You know what? We're going to actually take advantage of this plot already over here. <clears throat> Lady Goo Goo? No, I, I know it's Lady Gaga. That's why it's Lady Goo Goo. That's it's the whole point of the idea. That's the point of it. That's why we named it Lady Gugu to, 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 to reference Lady Gaga because it's a Gugu -goo bird. <laughs> you buy the Gugu food from the 
great great goo goo lady. <laughs> okay, good shout. There we go. Send it. There we go. Not in your game? Wait, you're telling me in your game the the bird is not the birds aren't named Goo Goos? They're not the Goo Goo birds? What are they named in your game? Okay. Uh let's we have like this like you know this, right? Let's see. That looks like this doesn't look like it. This looks like a radish, right? Yeah, that that's not correct. We can at least make a little bit of money, though. I don't know if I'm going to need those. What, what is this actually called? What do they call it in the game? What do they call it? Uh, they call it... Did I just eat one of those? No. White radishes. Okay, so white radish, radish, radishes. Exotic grilled fish. Very well. Apples. I could eat, I could eat or sell that. Um, leaves. Leaves, no particular use. I guess we could sell that, too. Flower petals. There's a lot of them we can use, right? Let's get this. Let's kind of like organize the hot bar like a little bit, right? I'm gonna use those lamps some way or some way or another. Do we really have one onion seed? What the heck? Fish, fish, fish. We're gonna sell those fishes too. Yeah, I know the guy already came, right? I mean, he's right there. He's like praying to the gods or something, but. Uh, we'll, we'll put some stuff in there. There we go. Uh, can we just transfer that? Yeah. You five hundred and forty dollars for three apples? What the heck? That seems uh, a lot. Like my lord. They gotta be made of bird seed. Why does that feel like a lot? Huge cow catfish, a hundred. White radishes. I'm gonna sell. Yeah, you know what? Sell them all. We'll sell that. Can we sell all that too? Starfish. Two. Wait, two thousand dollars for the starfish. That makes me feel like I need to hold on to it. <laughs> if it's that much money. Holy crap! I'm gonna hold on to the wheat, obviously. Sell the flowers. 3529. He'll come back tomorrow for that, right? Okay. Okay, let's let's get the wheat down real quick. Let's finish that up too. Wow. That seemed like a lot of money for certain for those certain items. I guess money goes a long way here in the world of Song of the Prairie. And to be fair, though, we still have this, like, kind of weird backstory. Like, we're a hero and all, right? I still got that going on for us. There we go. Okay. What's T do? Oh, hi. Did you hear that? Hit me that one more time, please. Hi. Hello. Nice. <laughs> Uh, dude, you're not going to be fed today. I'm sorry. I forgot that when you adopt an animal, you have to feed it. <laughs> oh. Ah, very good. I've seen on Steam complaining now that there are some syllables that are forbidden in game. For an example, you are. Maybe they are considered offensive in Chinese. Oh, that's confusing. You don't think 2K, 2K is a lot in this game? Okay, that's, that's the thing. I haven't really bought anything in this game to really kind of like know like what is what is a lot and what is not a lot, right? So now we have to water everything. Oh, look at that thing. Wow. Nice. Wasn't flowers a payment for clothes? Yeah, so you need like flowers and stuff and well, there's a lot of different materials you need for t to, to not only buy the clothing, but also to make the clothing. Yeah. The, cl the little outfit I want, right? It needs, I need flax. Yeah, I need flax. 
Oh, what do we need to do for the mayor, too? I gotta see what we need to do for the mayor. Oh, yeah, we need to use... We need to sell a bunch of stuff for the mayor. That's what it was. Oops, I definitely double-clicked that. So it's a good thing we have a bunch of stuff in the, um... In the box already going. It's a seller's market, apparently. <laughs> Oh, 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 no, uh, no, 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 goo, 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 G uh, got, sir, excuse me, hello, hey, 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 uh, uh, give you, oh my god, Were you sleeping or were you dying? Is that sleeping behavior? I, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know if he's just sleeping or if he's dying. <laughs> I don't know, dude. What is he doing? <laughs> That's the sleeping behavior? Oh my lord. So they sleep in this game? Like the birds like actually like lay on their backs and like take a snooze? What the heck? Oh yeah, yeah. Needs a pacifier? My lord. That's crazy. Never have I ever played a farming game where the bird, chicken, poultry, whatever you want to call it, ever decided to lay on its back and take a nap. I was scared. I was gen like I thought I done did it. The goddess could come and wreck me now for my terrible being. Right? Yeah. All right, we need to go get food. Let's go get food. That's like top priority this morning. Do we even have money for food? We have 110. <laughs> uh, wheat for bird food, move stuff. Oh yeah, let's go actually here. We should be able to travel there now and talk to Lori. It looks like it's dying? That's exactly what I thought. It does look like it's dying. Are you open today, Lori? It's Thursday. Are you not open yet? When does people wake up? It's 9 a.m. I'm gonna sit in her chair. Character relations calendar memo. Wait, what? What's her hours? I swear, if she's closed today. View status. Our days off are Monday to Sunday. I wish. Wait, what? I'm so, <laughs> I'm so confused with this. Off hours, Sunday. Business hours 10 to 1800 our days off are Monday to Sunday. I wish oh, okay. I see she's making a joke got it. Never mind Okay, I'm good. She's making a joke. So she should be here now. You should be here at 10 a.m. Correct? Hi. Don't hide the sign Okay, 10 a.m. Right. We'll wait for her to show up at 10 a.m. And we'll get two thousand dollars for the quest that she will do Yep Oops, hang on a sec. There we go. Whoop. Wait, what'd that say? Emergency escape? <laughs> and that said like emergency exit, please. <clears throat> What's the special looking plants? I don't know. I'm kind of interested. Man. Won't you at least cut me some slack during the break time? Lori, it's 10 a.m. I did your duty. Oh, you have fixed the station, hasn't he? I guess I'm a he. From now on, I'm just considered a he. Well done. This is my thank you gift for you. Come to see me in the future. That must be the... What did I just get? Is that the remodeling hammer? What did I get? No? 
Got any more tasks? Please help me move the seed bucket near the small pond outside of town to the side of blank. To the side of what? You didn't finish your sentence. Mission received. Move stuff. I knew that you will that you I knew that you will come to help me. I ordered a shipment of seeds, but the delivery man, uh, all one word by the way, said he couldn't find the general store, so he left the things near the pond outside the town and left. Can you help me? Just move the seed bucket to the container at the grocery store. It's just a piece of cake for you. Please? Outside wait. I know what you I know you told me what to say, but I didn't digest it. <laughs> I know what you told me. What you I know what you just said to me. I just I honestly don't even remember what you just said though. I'm sorry, excuse me? Uh, one more time for me? Uh, hit me with that again, sorry. To the side of the display stand in front of the general store. Your general store, right? Can you help me move the seed bucket near the small pond outside of the town? Okay, so it's 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 probably down here, right? The small pond outside of town. My lord, I don't know why that was such a freaking mind buster, right? I need to get food for the Goo Goo Gaga, Elio. Oh, I didn't water this over here. Hang on, let me water this before I absolutely forget it too. My lord. Trust says, thank you for the laughs. I have to go now, but I will watch the rest tomorrow. Have a great night. Have a good rest of your night as well. And thank you for becoming a member of the channel. I do appreciate that. Thank you very much. And have a wonderful rest of your evening. So much of this makes me feel like it's my time at Porsche. Yeah, I agree. Oh, there's the seed bucket right there. <clears throat> hey, Candace. How you doing, Candace? Okay, so that's the bucket we're looking for. Thank you. Can I fill my water up here? You think, right? In any other game, you can. Good, you can. That's a nice. I like that. All right, let's grab it. Pick it up. Thank you. <laughs> this game is cute but confusing at the same time. I agree. I think it's cool. I'm enjoying it. I do get confused at times, but, you know... It looks like a bucket. It looks like a stack of barrels. I know. <laughs> I guess put it down there. It should be enough to help Lori move her stuff here. I hope so. Ah, it just fell over. Uh, I didn't do that. So sleepy, you choose what you want. Yeah, yeah, you and that freaking sleepy. The flax seed will be really good because we can then get that kind of growing and maybe buy a new outfit and all that. So thank you. And I guess we got relationship points with Lori too. This is my thank you gift for you. <laughs> I love that. This is my thank you gift for you. Appreciate it. Thank you for the thank you gift for me. Okay. There, there is a health meter, right? Yeah, there is a health meter. So there must be like baddies in this game to some degree too. Like in the deep mines where it's like the death mines or whatever the heck it's called. All right, let's go talk to Goo Goo and get some freaking Goo Goo uh, seeds. Hello. Hi, how are you, Goo Goo Bird Avery? Goo Goo, hello, Goo. Uh, whoops, sorry, my bad. Uh, goo, hello, goo, 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 goo. Feed. Coming in clutch with the 1% off. I appreciate the drip. Now, luckily, we only have one bird. So let's just buy 10 for now. That should hold us off for 10 days. We'll see where we are at in the future there. Thank you. We got feed. Maybe adopting a goo goo bird early was a wrong mistake. What is this guy asking for? Hello, customer. I wonder if that slacker Musa, Musu is working honestly. Maybe I should just cancel his days off. That way, even if he's lazy, I can still get my money's worth. White radish? Oh. 
crap. I just sold all the white radish. Actually, I do have that in my in my box, I guess. I could get that for him, right? Real quick, if I hurry back. I'll take the Piggy Express, please, and thank you. I guess. By the way, Mikola, thanks for subscribing as well. Thank you, Mikola. Mikola. Let me go get the radishes. And then pull it out of the box and give it to him. I didn't know he need radishes. I just need three of them. Recycle. I hope that means put back into my inventory. It does. Got it. Thank you. Okay. Uh, let's go back to... There. Guild station. Yep. A Zion Dragon, have a good one. Going to sleep. I really enjoy your streams. Have a lovely time. I had lots of laughs. Thank you. Have a good rest of your evening. Thanks for hanging out with us. Do take care. Let's see here. Uh, no. Other person? A gentleman with the... Yes, you. With the hat? Hello. How are you? Uh, don't you want to bring home a cute animal? I, no. No. I just want to give you these radishes so I can make a little bit of money and get a little bit of extra skill, baby. Thank you. Nice. Alright. Cool. Oh, I guess that really kind of paid for almost all of our feed. Wait, does he have another quest for us? What's your other quest, buddy? Flower petals. Oh, okay. That's not too hard. Easy enough. A thousand dollars for some flower petals. I could do that. Ooh. There's flowers everywhere in this game. So it's not that hard to do. I do want to plant my fla flask. My flax. Not my flask. Look. I'm not drinking on the job here. Everybody else in this town is drinking on the job. I, for one, am not. Our quest time? It doesn't seem like it, no. <laughs> wait, is there some- wait, wait, whoa, 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 let's go in here. This is the mayor, right? Mr. Mayor lost my hat? Oh, he put his hat on, yeah? He did put his hat on. Hello, buddy. Young person, are you settled into your life in, in the new town, I guess? Sure. Mission target, white radishes. You want white radishes, too. All right, very well. Everybody wants radishes, I guess. Can I just pick all these flowers? Like, look at this. This feels like a community garden. And I'm over here picking all the, uh, the flowers. So I can give it to a very rude man that has a red hat. Well, look at me go. There we go, we got 50. Church florist, we haven't talked to this person yet. I, she looks kind of cool. Amy, greetings, Kanzella. You came a little earlier than I did. <laughs> what? Why do you know my name? My name is Amy. I'm the gardener of this town, an ordinary flower seller. At the same time, I am also a seer into the future. I learned your name from the future, and I knew that we would meet today. Dude, everybody is awesome. Whether you believe me or not, fate will go towards the established ending because fate is in is inescapable. At least by now, no one had been able to defy fate. It sounds like it's possible for someone to defy fate. I see the future in my dreams. Usually the closer the future is, the more clearly I can see it, as if I'm really there. But this is not the case with your future. Even the future you saw yesterday was blurry, as if it could disappear at any time. This is the first time I have encountered this situation since I awakened my ability, but we still meet- we still met here. Maybe I'm the one who came to change the fate? Although I don't mean to discourage you, fate is not something one can easily change. Sorry, I shouldn't be talking about this. Let's change the topic. You seem to have the power to open the doors to other people's hearts. In the future I saw, there is a person in the town who is about to open his or her heart to you. You should try to find that person. May the goddess bless you. Well, I've kind of been forced into the fact that I think that person will have to be the restaurant lady. That chick is, uh... I'm not running away from that chick. That chick is, uh... She's coming after me. She's coming after me hard, too. Yeah. 
After favorability reaching a certain value, wait, what? After reach after favorability reaching a certain value, you can press R to enter the character's inner world. <gasps> what? The heck does that mean? Enter the inner world. What? So if we become likable by somebody, we can go into their inner world? I mean, honestly, I don't know if I want to go into any of these people's inner world. I barely even want to be in their outer world. <laughs> Alright, let's go talk to the crazy spicy lady in the restaurant that absolutely wants to take us down town. Hello, how are you? Good to see you. Hey D Rose, how you doing? Just finished the watching the change. Love the game now. I love the game now. Can't wait for the real ending. Oh, very good. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Little cute cutie. Yep. I, I should have expected that. Little cutie, I know quite a few fairy tales from the eastern continent. Would you like to hear them? Shit. What is your task? Clear broth noodles. So you want clear broth noodles. Now wait a sec. I think somebody else on the map also said something about that, right? Over here, clear bro broth noodles. Let's go to the hospital and see what that is first, and then I'll be back with you, you, you insane woman. Yo, can I actually harvest these? These aren't mine. Can I have them? <gasps> you can! Well, there you go. I'm gonna take their... I'm gonna take her white radishes and I'm gonna give it to the mayor then. How you like me now, mayor? Or spicy restaurant lady? Let's go. That worked out. <laughs> that worked out indeed. You just love it. Treasury of Tombs. Oh, baby. Thank you for becoming a member of the channel. Look at you go. Thank you for that. Thank you for becoming a member. I appreciate the support. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. I hope you're doing well. That was very kind of you. Very kind indeed. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome, welcome indeed. Hello, is there anything wrong with you? I don't think so. Clear broth noodles, three. Okay, so he's asking for that too as well. Our reward is we will get 16 wheat. Very well. All right, so let's kind of maybe look into, well, let's go back to the mayor. We'll give the mayor the white radishes. And then I think I might try to cook something in this game. We'll see. I'll try to cook something in this game though. See how well that goes. Oh yeah, don't forget to take the flower petals as well. Yeah, that's a good idea too. There's so much. So much to do, and like so little time to do it. Hello. Uh, view tasks, white radishes, nine perfectly. <laughs> and gold coins and friendship points, because I want to go inside your inner world. Sigh. Seeing a young person like you coming to the town, I remember those years when I ran towards the setting sun. This was my lost youth. Sigh. It's a pity that the good buddy I was with was lost a year ago. Let me give you a commission. Please bring me nine white radishes. I just did that. That's my buddy's favorite food. Sir. There you go. Thank you, young person. Even now, I can still recall the days when I ran with him. Maybe one day I can find him. Please keep this, young person. This is your reward. Appreciate it, man. Uh, oh, don't sit down. Oh, this is uh, awkward. Get up. Oh, don't go inside of her either. Uh, greet. Kanzella, is there anything you need help with? Try to enter Wallace's inner world. <laughs> okay. How do I get in there? Uh, after sorting out these financial statements and the personal scheduling, I had to find time tonight to do the annual report for... Dot, dot, dot. How am I supposed to go inside her inner world if I can't, like, do other tasks to help her? Maybe I have to give her, like, items? Like, if I gave you this fish, would you like it? Thanks. 
No problem. Inner world. Oh, here we are. We're in the inner world. Holy crap. Everybody put on their seatbelts because I don't know what the heck is happening. Yep. You'll be happy to know Kayla heard you say, is something wrong with me? And then she thought someone asked you in the chat and she was ready to throw hands on your behalf. Oh. You're telling me uh, Kayla is a spice one now, are you? Huh? She take no ish? Is that what you're telling me? Huh? Watch out. Hey. All right, here we go. Inner world. In the inner world, you can have a variety of interactions with characters, including observation, taking, topic. What the heck does that mean? <laughs> taking topic? Through interaction, you have the opportunity to explore the inner secrets of the character. Oh. When the cursor changes, you can click to interact with a character. But when the red exclamation mark appears, your interaction might irritate the character. I don't know what any of this is meaning. In acquire mode, you can try to acquire some of the belongings of the character you are interacting with. But any failure will increase the alarmness of the character against you. When the alarmness of a character reaches 100, his or her inner world will be shut to you. Acquired check topic. Right. There's inner percentage 0.0% .0 withered tulips, the secret of the I don't know, blossom in the I don't know, pocket watch, coming of age. This music seems a little off-putting for this inner world stuff. I will check you. Check. <laughs> I don't want to click that, but the game is telling me to click it. Why are we clicking that? Your hand are smaller than mine. They are so cute. <laughs> this game is freaking wild. She liked it. Oh, goodness. Help me. <sighs> Mouth. Expression on her face seems that she is burdened with concern. You think? I just touched her. Is there anything I can help you with? I have no idea. I really don't. You are so beautiful. I can't stop looking at you. Oh, I want to kiss you. There's something on your face. Dude, this is weird. This is getting weird. <laughs> this is getting weird. I can't stop looking at you. You're so beautiful. Thank you, hearing you say that. I'm really happy. Is this supposed to be a romantic thing that I'm doing here? Topic. Talk about the past. Acquire. Talk about past. In fact, my past was nothing special. I grew up in this small town. There used to be a lot of residents in this town. Everyone loved the town and lived every day happily. Oh dear, we were talking about me, but I couldn't help bringing up the town again. That's not what you wanted to hear, right? I can't help it. After all, I'm the secretary of this town. I bet you are. I bet you are. What's your opinion of me? She doesn't seem to want to talk more today. Let's talk next time. Okay, then let me check her out. Excuse me, let me just kneecap you real quick. It feels weird. Please don't touch there. I know, I agree. I don't know what the hell I'm doing here, lady. You couldn't help yourself and touched her leg. I, I know. Oh my goodness. She was terribly shocked. She rejected you. I agree. I agree. Hey. What the hell just happened? 
When your interaction offends a character in the inner world, the character will close his or her inner world to you. Therefore, you are in the inner world. Please take caution. God damn it, I need like a hazard. What the heck? I honestly did not know the inner world was something intimate, okay? That's not what we... Why am I on top of her head? I'm... I... Don't look up my dress. Jesus. I... This game is out of control. I have forgotten what I have been playing. I didn't know the inner world was an intimate part of life. She was okay when I touched her in the other area, but she's like, don't touch my knees, dude. She told me specifically, oh, your hands are so small. I like that. And I'm like, <laughs> crying inside. I guess I'm gonna cook. What the hell am I gonna cook? I don't know. Menu, please. Clear broth. What do I need for that? Wheat? Start cooking. I need four of these. No, I need no, no, I need four. Give me four. I need three for the hospital, one for your spicy ass. Goodness gracious. Did I cook? Was that it? Did I do it? What did I do? Excuse me. Start cooking? At what did I just do? Did I do it? I did do it. Alright. You. Little cutie, want something to eat? Today's dishes are delicious. <laughs> I don't know what I want. But you can have this. Little cutie, are you here to see me? Like a baby bird who just left the nest? You make people worry about you. To reward your good behavior, let me teach you to cook a dish. Put two pieces of wheat into the stew and you can make clear broth noodles if lucky. I just did that. What are you talking about? You teaching me how to- I just gave that to you. Unless I just- No, I, I made that, right? I didn't order that from you. I made that. If you are worried about your cooking skills, it may be helpful for you to take a look at the recipes over the stove. Isn't it easy? Give it a try, little cutie. I have it right here for you. I promise. Little cutie, I know quite a few fairy tales from the eastern continent. Would you like to hear from them? No. Just- Give me my friendship points and let me get the hell out of here. You can have this recipe. Now you can learn another dish. A little cutie, there are many more recipes that you will need to explore yourself. I'm sure you can do it. I bet you her inner world is spicy as hell. <laughs> her inner world, that that's... You might get lost in the sauce there. <laughs> Why do I have a feeling that you're just going to fall right on into that inner world? Holy crap. This is an incredible game so far. Hi, how are you? Yes. Hello, is there anything wrong with you? <laughs> Everything. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm too busy with work to leave now. Please go to the restaurant and bring me three bowls of clear broth noodles. I'll pay you for your trouble. If you can, please get it quickly. I don't want it to affect my work. Work makes one feel fulfilled inside, and the delicious clear broth noodles empower one to work harder. Dude, I, I, I hear you, but I'm right here with it. There you go. How delicious. I can't wait to eat up these three bowls of clear broth noodles. Here's your reward. I will start, start working after I finish eating. So he gave us 16 wheat, which that's good, but my lord. What's today? This is the fourth day of spring. Oi. The demo was not this spicy. <laughs> Holy crap. I feel like I'm like two clicks away from a sexual harassment suit coming my way. 
My God. Oh, look at the sunset, though. That's wonderful. Um, hello. Yeah, hello to you, too. Don't follow me. You don't want to get in my inner world. Trust me. It has a lot of violations within it. No! Yes? Hello, what a coincidence to see you again. After you stalked me halfway down the, the road here. Stop following me. I'm not giving up my inner world. Get away. No, it's my flower, not yours. Stop it. Leave me alone. You people are crazy. Don't touch me with your little hands. Get away. <laughs> what do you want? Leave me alone. Every day I think about what it takes to become a man like Uncle Hart. I don't care. Take your nonsense elsewhere. Do not follow me into my house. We will have issues. You stay out there. Let me check my emails. Lindy, dear sweetheart, I would like to remind you that you can issue a fishing commission to me. I will complete your commission. Everything caught during this period belongs to you, even including my heart, and I will only accept a little reward. Dude, why is everybody in this town so freaking horny? What the hell's the deal? The aphrodisiacs are strong with this town. My ass needs to go to sleep after a day like this. Jesus. Another fun day is over? Time for bed? Yeah, if that's what you want to call it. Sure, dude. Whatever. Another fun day. 3200 dollars Sure, I'll take it. What the heck? Amy's letter. Kenzella, excuse me, I don't know if you are interested in growing flowers. I opened up a flower shop in the town. If you are interested, you can come to me in the garden next to the church. The seeds of these flowers are a gift for you. Putting butterfly, butterfly flowers next to them may produce flowers of unexpected colors. Butterfly station, white. I've seen that word, I just don't, I forgot how to pronounce it. Is it right? White penny seeds? Red penny seeds? Peony? Peony seeds? Yeah. Look. Just give me the freaking seeds. Butterfly flower. Butterfly flowers can be made using a crafting table. Placing butterfly flowers in the flower field of the farm will enable the flowers of the same kind in the surrounding 7x7 seven seven plot to crossbreed and change colors. That's actually kind of cool. <coughs> Thank you for the email, though. New construction blueprint, Butterfly Station. I didn't feed my chicken last night. <laughs> oh, crap. Sorry, chicken. As you can see, I came home with someone chasing me. I apologize. Demand for food, number of animals. There you go. There you go. There you go, Goo Goo, Lady Goo Goo. Enjoy it. Holy crap. I feel like I've been a failed fa Oh, a failed farmer. I don't feel like I've done anything correct in this game yet. And everybody just seems to be very, very, very hormonal. And I guess they're trying to per convince me that I should get into everybody's inner world. That's what the game's telling me. The game says, hey, you need to go into these people's inner world. I don't know if I really want to. That's massive, though. That's a big white radish. Is that ready to go? Yeah, those are ready to go, dude. Nice. I'm flabbergasted. Yeah, I, yeah, exactly that. Happy Friday to you, Lorianne. How you doing? This is crazy, dude. This game is crazy. <laughs> it 
silver white radish that seems like it, it's a it's a lot of money yeah i'll be real with you when i hit play and when i hit stream on today's game i didn't know what we were getting ourselves into i think we absolutely know what we're what we've got ourselves into this is this is something dude you know strangely enough though i will say i'm still having a good time yeah still having a good time you know it's almost like that thing where it's like you want to know what's next like what else can this game do to just throw you a curveball right that's kind of how i'm feeling what else can what else can you do what else can you bring me right that's what i'm that's what i'm saying what else can you do to surprise me we'll put down some flax Hey, Lindy, how you doing, Lindy? What's going on? Hope you're doing well. <sighs> they do curse in this game, too. <laughs> we saw that, dude. That, that caught me by... That was probably one of the first things that maybe caught me by surprise. Is they were cursing in this game, too. They did say A to the hole. You can't say that on television, but you can say it in Song of the Prairie. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what the age demographic for this game would would be. I know for a fact if I was like a kid, you know, and I was a kid growing up and I was playing Harvest Moon 64, you know, and I I found that game super innocent, you know. And uh Never thought of anything really. I got like, oh yeah, okay. So people love each other. They say sweet nothings to each other. You know, I, I get it. Then they get married and live happily ever after. Never did I expect that I would start touching people in this game. Like, you know, so if kids are gonna be playing a farming sim like this, I don't, you know, I don't know. You got to expect them to, to to get into people's inner worlds and start copping a feel a little bit. <laughs> I don't know, dude. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying my best over here. That's all I got to say. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Interesting. Definitely, definitely interesting. I think we're all on the same page here for the most part. Right? It's weird because they swear, but then you can't have curses in names. Oh my god, that's so true. Yeah, so the NPCs swear at some points in this game, but you're not allowed to do it in the game because the game censors you for swearing. What the heck is happening? That's one seed. Um, let's put the other, uh, sorry, other onion. Let's put the last bit of, is that onion? Yeah, onion. Let's put the last bit of onion in there. You're right about that. That's hilarious. I guess, can I just place it somewhere right there? Yeah? Okay, that's that's fine. There we go. We'll kind of mix this little plot here. There we go. Hey, Spec Bites says, I was hoping you would show this game before I purchased it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're definitely showing it off. We're giving it a full effort here. Um... It's a definitely a spicy one. We've gone through a lot in the last three hours. A lot of crazy emotions, for sure. Um, let's see here. Oh, yeah, we forgot to do the flowers. We forgot to give the flowers to the guy. Let's go give the flowers to the guy, right? And we also need 20 more wheat, so we need to buy more wheat as well. Can you fill it with the water at the lake? Yeah, you can use that. You can use the lake in the in the pond, I believe. Yeah. <clears throat> There's a Steam review that says "Story of Seasons, but with more quests and mentally unwell NPCs." <laughs> oh goodness gracious! Hello. 
Dear customer, don't want you to bring in a cute animal. No, 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 no cute animals right now, my good man. Oh, I needed 30, not 50. That's fine. There we go. I think you should have heard that time is money. I can't leave here to make money, but my little number 13 suddenly wants to eat petals. So my customer, I can only ask you to go down and collect 30 petals. Look, I got you, my good man. We got you. We got you. We got it. We got it. It's right here. It's right here. There you go. There you go. Yep. Yep. There you go. Time is money. Wonderful. Yep. Hey. I didn't expect you, dear customer, to complete the commission so quickly. Thank you very much for your work. I will therefore also offer my gratitude. Three large bottles of milk or a healthy smile. You can choose one to take with you. Doesn't smiling mean not going to give anything? What the heck did I just say? Ah. But dear customer, you can reap the friendship between us as well as healthy and sunny smiles. Isn't that the smile of a profiteer? Dear customer, choose for yourself. As a good business partner, I won't force you to make a choice. Three large bottles of milk, a healthy smile. Nah, dude, give me three large bottles of milk. I don't want your freaking smile. Hmm. What a pleasant cooperation, dear customer. I hope our cooperation will become more and more harmonious. Dear customer, this is your reward. Thank you? I think? Yeah, I think I accomplished something there. <laughs> oh. I need to talk to Wallace and really explain myself to her and be like, uh, yeah. Sorry about that inner world episode. I hope you're okay. Is she in here? We gotta talk to him. Kenzella, good afternoon. Talk about yourself. Oh, about me? Don't worry. Uh, don't you already know it very well? All right, well, if you insist, I'll cut you some slack. I'm Wallace, the secretary of the town. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Uh, talk about hobbies. She doesn't seem to want to talk more today. Let's talk next time. Let's check her and touch her again. Oh. Let's, let's do the nose. Is there anything I can help you with? I want to kiss you. You're so beautiful. Look, I can't stop looking at you. You are so beautiful, I can't stop looking at you. Thank you, hearing you say that, I'm really happy. You're welcome. Now, she's gonna get upset if I touch her knees again, right? It feels weird, please don't touch down there. <laughs> All of it's weird, dude. All of it is too weird. Do you have a task, though? <laughs> Today is Freya's birthday. If it's convenient, can you help me say happy birthday to her? She will be very happy. Okay. Let's go to... Let's go to visit Lit... <laughs> let's go to visit... Let's go visit Lindy? Wait a sec. What am I doing? Oh, okay. I wonder if you have time. There's something I want to ask you to do. I want you to visit Lindy. Freya. Lori. Maybe you already know them, but that doesn't matter. To be honest, the three of them were my childhood playmates. At the same time, they were the troublemakers in town. I hope you can help me find out what's going on with them before they get into any trouble. Don't worry, all you need to do is go and say hello to them. This is my personal request, but I will pay you nonetheless. <laughs> I will really appreciate it. Okay. No problem. <laughs> What's happening, Can has a knee fetish? Dude, you should have seen it before. The game wanted me to touch her in her between the leg spot, and I touched her there, and then the game said, oh, you have small hands, and I got really uncomfortable. I think I laughed uncontrollably because that was me being uncomfortable. Yeah, I don't know, dude. I don't know what's going on. Crocs badge, childhood friends, a healthy egg? Wheat for the bird feed? We don't have 20 yet. Do we need to go to Lindy, yeah? Memo. Oh. Oh, we could go talk, talk to Hart. Oh, okay. Was Hart in there? I wonder if Hart was in there. Let me see. Was Hart in there? He might have been in there, and I just walked past him. Hart! 
Did I walk past you, buddy? <clears throat> Hello, heart. Yep. Liz is always too strict with herself. Sometimes I really wish she could, uh... Who's Liz? Do they mean live? Did they mess up? Who's Liz? Did we, have we met Liz? Young person, little mod told me that your farm has completed 50 shipments. I guess so. Well done. I believe that you have earned a considerable income. The farm will soon be on track to great success. As agreed, these flax seeds are your reward. When you harvest the flax, you can take it to a Tuya at the fashion store to make some fitting new clothes. Trust me, the clothes she makes are very comfortable. Yeah, I, I would love to do that. Absolutely. I will say the quests in this game are really confusing too. To kind of like understand what you should be going or where you should be going. Plant 30 harvest plant. Please, oh, sorry, sorry. Please harvest 30 units of crops. That should be done soon. We got to go visit Lindy. And apparently we picked up a contract of buy black bean fish. Who the heck is Jin? Because your master, because your master me is rich, I'm going to buy them all. What? Is there a piggy express somewhere? Yeah. Try to get to Lindy as fast as we can here. Church garden station? Take me there. Not me hearing it like it's my name. <laughs> I mean, I understand her. Knee touching is horrible. I'm so ticklish it hurts. I'm ticklish too, dude. Hey, ain't no, ain't no getting around that. They don't do anything other than mess up names and text. Like, I'm assuming they were meeting Liv, right? And they said Liz. Oh shoot! I just hit my sticky key action. That was. Weird. Whoops. Sorry about that, folks. <laughs> Are you going to get new clothes? Yeah, I'm going to get new clothes. I'm going to get the outfit that I want. That outfit I keep eyeballing. What is that big baddie? Weeds, witch, wild fruits. Level up. I'll take a couple of those, please, and thank you. Oh god, here comes Lindy. Hey, Lindy. It's Freda's birthday again. What should we prepare to surprise her? Honestly, a ticket to get the hell out of here. Childhood Fred? What? Wallace sent you here? Did she say anything to make you alert to me? Did she? Don't listen one bit to her nonsense. Okay. Sweetheart, is there anything I can do for you? A sign. Silver Sand Bay. No. Should I do it? Should I go into Lindy's inner world? Take me inside, I guess. Hello, Lindy. Playboy? What? Playboy? Is that a decoration piece, or is that is, is that Playboy? The flowers? Are the flowers called Playboy? I had to check to see if the game wanted me to touch Lindy's. Uh... <laughs> a bouquet bouquet of flowers, a charming rose. He probably often uses it to pick up girls. Okay. Shh, sweetie, can you hear it? This flower is saying that you are the most beautiful girl in the world, and it longs to be by your side. Thank you. I knew that this rose would suit you perfectly. I hope it can keep you company on my behalf. Okay. Um. See, it wants me to touch the pants again! It wants me to grab... Uh, 
I don't dislike girls for taking initiative, but could this be just a little too much? Oh my god. Oh, this game! What is happening? I just grabbed him in, a, in the junk, dude. And he says, please don't touch my junk. I, I appreciate girls and, and all, and I love when they take initiative, but just don't touch my junk right now. It not It's not the time. It's not the time. This is probably one of the craziest farming games I've ever played in my entire life. bubble a floating bubble with something vaguely inside hmm huh what's up uh you need to do what the heck does that say you need to do you need to do to freya a good impression needs kindness what the hell air bubble floating bubble with something vaguely inside Phew. today i was stopped by mrs lord by miss lori to help her move stuff again I'm not complaining. Reaching out to a girl in need is just a basic manner. Speaking of which, I always feel like that the handkerchief in Miss Lori's hand looks a little familiar. Bro, don't even tell me you have a sock by the bed. Tell me about Playboy? <laughs> Playboy? Who? I don't know. You tell me. Some people in this town are jealous of my handsome and of my handsome and always spread rumors about me, such as faithlessness, flirting everywhere. This is ridiculous. Maybe my behavior is easily misunderstood, but I am fundamentally different from those playboys. This is a heart full of love. I think more important than behavior is what kind of heart you have. Only discuss behaviors regarding of willingness. You have no good intention. Kindness is the most important thing. Yes, the heart is the most important. I, I, I did not say that. Uh, if everyone can think so, the world will be full of love. I guess so. Whatever you say, dude. Whatever you say. Talk about the princess. He doesn't seem to want to talk about it. Okay. Talk about fishing. He doesn't want to seem to talk about it. Talk about poetry? He doesn't want to seem to talk about it. A choir? Let me pop your bubble, dude. A choir? Oh, success rate, 5%. Not good. Not good. So I wonder if we have to, like, somehow, like, pop these bubbles in some context, right? I will check... Your hair. It says red exclamation mark, which I guess is bad, right? Let's see. Hair. Multiple shades of blue hair. It is some kind of fashion. Sweetheart, why are you staring at me? He seems to be anticipating something. Touch his hair. Talk to him. I'm on a time. Uh, touch his ace. Facebook requires it. Touch his hair. Touch it and see what happens. Sweetheart, your hand feels familiar to me. Someone used to touch my hair like this before. Was it your other sweetheart? Was it your mom? Or I'm going to be jealous? <laughs> no, I'm not going to be jealous. I'm not, I promise. Your other sweetheart? Your mother? Was it your mom that used to touch you, your hair like that? Don't say anything so stupid, although you guessed right. How is it stupid if I guessed right? I haven't seen her for a long time since I left the sea country. Okay. So I guess that was good. We did we did good. Topic. Talk about the color of the sea. Honey, I don't seem to have good I don't seem to have told you that I come from the distant uh, sea country. Very well. In my hometown there is an endless sea of on all sides. The blue of the sea is the color of our life. Blue is the color of the sea country. Each of us is proud of having blue hair. It's a beautiful color. I agree. Honey, thank you for your compliment. But in my eyes, you are the most beautiful color. Thank you. I guess. <laughs> Hang on a sec. Let me just... Uh... 
block that. Thank you. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Lindy is a boy. Yeah, Lindy is a boy. I guess in this game. Is there anything else I can check on you, my good man? I can check your eyes? Affectionate eyes. As if they are looking at a lover. I heard that just by staring into someone's eyes for 10 seconds, you can tell them, you can tell if this person likes you. I seem to have heard this from somewhere before. You are imagining things. What do you want to say? Oops, I am caught. I do like you. Thank you. Should we talk about that? <laughs> I don't know, dude. I really am not sure. This is such a confusing part of the game. I will, I will be honest with you. I love the fact that he hates the fact that I grabbed his junk. I mean, I get it. I feel you, brother. I think we're good on topics. He doesn't want to talk about anything, right? So I think we're fine. Get me the hell out of here. Do you want to exit the inner world? Yeah, and stand right on top of him. All right. Well then. The red exclamation mark at the touch is a no-no in the inner world. Well, we, we, we touched it and we progressed it though. I don't think it's a no-no, right? I think there's a chance of it because we touched the red exclamation mark and it progressed the, uh, the, the other stuff. And plus I think the playboy, the, the, um, the flowers were red exclamation mark. Yeah. Wow. It's crazy. I, I, I mean, I don't know. Right? What do you think? What's going on here? Let's go visit. Let's go to visit Freya. Okay. Right? Let's go visit. To, let's go visit Freya. Yeah. Yeah, let's go visit. Let's go visit Freya. Where the hell is Freya? <laughs> Freya. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on here? Is that the- oh god, G-U. She's crazy. Becky. Do. Freya. I forgot who Freya looks like or what Freya is all about. Freya. Freya! Take- oh, Freya is the li librarian. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I remember Freya. Okay, librarian. Also goes as Leia, I guess. Two identities, right? It's kind of an RPG interaction. It's actually very common in games on the Asian market, at least from what I've seen in pop culture. So you'd say in this kind of like dealio that we got going on here is 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 somewhat um, common, yeah? Hello. In fairy tales, this <laughs> in fairy tales, the princess birthday will be celebrated if Leia. Did did Wallace send you to visit Freya? Freya understood. Freya will be friends with Kenzella. Not nothing. Freya's going back to her reading. Okay. Did we do it? I think we did it. I think. I think Freya is good. So then, do we go talk to Wallace again? Or maybe? Hang on a sec. Uh, time out. Memos. Oh, visit Lori now. Okay, so we, we gotta go visit Lori. Okay, let's go visit Lori. Yeah. Got it. Okay. There needs to be like a, um... Like a pin. You know? Like, pin it... Pin it right here to the side of your, uh... Like, above my forehead type thing. Yeah. Let's go talk to, uh, Lori. I forgot to feed Goo Goo. I gotta go feed Goo Goo. I should have named it Grogu, dude. That conversation almost gave me a stroke. <laughs> what do you got going on here? What, what did you want? One piglet hogs the food. Two piglets dig for food. Three piglets he he heed. We'll have to come to me. G-U for food. What the hell did you just say to me? Silver onions. Oh, okay. Mission received. It's you, sweetheart. Are you here to help me? Haha. 
this the thing is my hometown has a delicacy called bamboo shoots not only are they delicious and nutritious nutritious but they also can be made into a variety of delicious dishes my god that was a lot of d's right there when i was a child i would go out to dig up bamboo shoots with my siblings every spring then we would bring the fresh bamboo shoots to the adults and they would make a large pot of delicious soup it's really nostalgic, the glorious spring days, the delicious bamboo shoot soup, and the lovely smiling faces of my younger brothers and sisters. Oops, sorry, I fell into a memory without realizing it. Anyway, out of nostalgia for my hometown food, I recently found an ingredient supplier from the east who can provide restaurants with fresh bamboo shoots. But the businessman himself is a discerning uh, gourmet and only sells ingredients to top-notch chefs. chefs. In order to gain his approval, I have to show my skills this time. But great food is inseparable from great ingredients. So, sweetheart, I'm counting on you. I need three silver onions. Please, sweetheart. You, you call me sweetheart one more time, you're going to have to take me out to dinner. You understand me, right? You understand me. You're going to have to take me to, like, Olive Garden or something. You understand me, right? You better... You better watch, watch yourself. So three silver onions, which we have silver, I think we have silver radishes, right? Silver radishes. Silver radishes, yeah. Oh, my lord. Uh, Lori, where are you at? I need to talk to you, Lori. Hey, Lori. So sleepy, you choose what you want. Childhood friend, as Wallace asked you to make friends with me, ha. Huh. Go and tell her that you and I have been good friends long ago. Uh, yeah, right, so you want me to lie. Perfect. Uh, hello, how are you, Rock? Or Croc? Um, what can I do for you? Just tell me. 10, 30 meters away. Wait, just tell me from 10, 30 meters away? What are you trying to imply? Miner's badge. It's you. I remember you live on the farm, right? Have you seen a framed badge? I may have dropped it in the farm mine while mining. It's really important to me. We have not been there yet. Okay, so now that we've done that, what, what have we got here? Let's go visit Lori, which we have we have done that, right? Submit? Grocery store? So we visit Lori. Now what we need to do is submit that to maybe Wallace, I guess? Go back to Wallace? Jesus. Hey, Monique, how you doing? Happy Easter. Oh, yeah, happy Easter to you. How you doing? Good to see you. Welcome in. Good to see you. Good to see you. Oh. <laughs> Do you need to wander the plot that is separate from the others? Yes. Yes. If you're talking, like, at my farm, yes. He's your best friend. He respects you a distance away. <laughs> Kanzel, is there anything to help you with? I've done everything. Have you met them already? They really don't give you peace of mind. If I could do better, maybe things would be different. Sorry for straying away from the original topic. This is your reward. Please accept it. Thank you. Appreciate it. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Oh. Okay. I want to buy... Let me see if I can quickly buy my new outfit, maybe. He's... He's on to you and all your knee touching. He is! How dare he! You go around touching everybody's knee and everybody's... Goo goo berries. How dare you? He's on to me. Sir, why are you running? Are we open here? Or are we closed here? I think we're closed here, right? Looks like we possibly closed. Change the style? You can change the style of the buildings, yeah? Interesting. You guys closed at 1800? Alright, so you guys just closed then. We gotta go feed our chicken. And maybe water our plants possibly too as well. Hey Daisy, how you doing? Jumping in to say hi, going back to watch from the beginning. You're in for a freaking treat. <laughs> Have fun. It's a freaking journey. It's a ride. I tell ya. You're in for a wild one. I played this two months ago, so what do you think? I feel it has a very mobile phone game feel to it. NPCs or something else? Uh, well, 
it definitely does have well no i i don't i personally don't think it feels like a mobile game to me but the npcs are the dialogue in this game are, are very interesting dialogue is interesting uh npcs are very interesting there's a lot of interesting kind of things happening is that the miner's badge that's the miner's badge i guess yeah it's 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 I don't know what to really say. <laughs> I don't. I don't know what to say. Hello. How you doing, Goo Goo Gaga Lady F? Oh, oh, you're already ready to go. So, okay, Goo Goo's good. Goo Goo's good. Yeah, Goo Goo's good. Anything else I want to actually try to maybe ship off? I don't think so. I have this, um... I'm gonna save this, uh, butterfly station, I guess, for the, for the flowers. We need that moving tool, too, as well. We need the remodeling hammer, right? I think Lori, is Lori supposed to give that to us, or do we have it? Is that it? Do we have it? Oh. Maybe we already have it? Okay. Well, that worked. I don't remember that. I don't know why it's grayed out, then. That shouldn't be grayed out. That's kind of weird that it is. Place it. That's what I wanted. There we go. That works out. There we go. Okay, uh, let's go to bed and we're gonna buy a new outfit tomorrow, I guess. There we go. Hey, Allison, how you doing, Allison? Interesting would be the way to describe this game. The farming felt a little more, little more, little more gamey to me. Little mobile. Mobile, maybe mobile gamey to you. Mobile, maybe that's what it was, right? Okay. All right. 6 a.m. Yeah, the, the time is in the top right-hand corner, too. We'll go ahead and feed Mr. Lady Goo Goo. Feed. Perfect. Water up our, pl our plants. My lord. This game is a... This game is a job. Yeah, this game is actually a job. So... A couple of silver onions. We only have one silver onion here. We might need to buy more onions, too. There we go. Damn it. I got an email. Who emailed me? Wallace's letter. Canzella, hello. Haven't you adapt? Adapt? It, I don't think that's how you spell adapt. Is it? That's not how you spell adapt, right? <laughs> have you adapted well here? I'm sorry I don't have time to come and see you myself. People from all over the world come to the town and set up stalls in the market in front of the guild every weekend. You can come and have a look during the day if you'd like to, but I would be happier if you come and see me. That is definitely not how you spell adapt. Well, all right. <laughs> it's missing the T. Yeah, I thought that was missing the T. <laughs> Um, so the weekends, market stalls are set up. Okay. Is today a weekend? Today's Saturday. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to look into that. Adapted, they meant? Yeah, they definitely meant adapted, right? <laughs> you know what? And to be fair, though. With all the troubles and kind of weird stuff that we've seen today. It is a mobile... Uh, no. <laughs> it is a mobile game. Look at me, I have that on the brain now. It is an early access game, too. So, early access. So it's going to be improved on. There's going to be content added to it. I think when it becomes a full version, it probably will be a banging one. Right? Very well received one. Pretty established one. A nice one, right? Um, right now... A lot of stuff going on, for sure. A lot of stuff going on. A lot of interesting things going on. Right? Go. Better missing a T than a D. <laughs> oh, are these ready? Are these? No, they're not ready to go. They have to be bigger. One thing that really uh, caught my eye about this game, too, was uh, how big the crops do get. I think it's fun having like massive, like just big crops. I think it's kind of fun. 
Yeah, the gameplay overall, optimization is there, for sure. Optimizations there, there hasn't been really any... I mean, there's been, like, some bugs. There, I will say, there's been some weird bugs. There was, like, bug... There was a bug in, like, the first 10 minutes with the fast traveling. Um, I think the... What the heck? What are you doing here? I think the way they do the quests is a little strange, where you have to, like, start the quests. Like, they have the quests already showing you what is going on and what you need. And so you gather the items, and then you have to, like, start the quest and get into the quest, and then accept the quest, and then deliver the quest. Like, the whole questing delivery is a little strange, but, um... Yeah, I mean, game gameplay-wise, it's, it's, it's there. Yeah, it's there. They said the game's gonna be in early access for a, for a year. They tried to at least make it for a year. If not, it might be longer. Um, it does say on, on Steam that they do plan on adding marriage to the game, so I don't know if you can get married quite yet. Um, but you can romance, I guess, to some degree. Um, and they did also say on Steam that they do plan on raising the price of the game when the full version comes out. So the game right now is $19.99 USD. 10% uh, off right now, uh, but they do plan on raising the price of the game when it's full release. They did say that. So just keep that in mind, too. I think it's $17.99 you can get the game right now. USD. $17.99. Um, let's see. Okay, we'll do the Crocs badge. Yep, we'll do the Crocs badge. We'll get that kind of taken care of. We decided to ignore the first bug. I like, yeah, I do like the, I like when the crops change when you water them too. I do like that. It's a nice little, little feature there too. <laughs> Have a good night, Natalie. Thanks for hanging out with us. Do take care. Have a good one. We need more wheat, I think. Maybe more onions. We need more, more onions. Hello, Lori. Are you almost about to open up your shop? You're closed tomorrow, so I, you know, today you need to be open, young lady. I'm sorry, I'm saving my inner world from when I'm married. Hello, Lori. So sleepy. Hi. Yeah, all right. Um, wait a sec. Are you not selling this stuff? Seeds can only be sown in... Wait a sec. Oh, sell. No, don't sell. Buy. Thank you. My goodness. Tomato seeds are new? Well, give me the tomato seeds, dude. How long did they take? Six days? Give me nine. Onion? Give me nine. We're still rocking that 1% discount. You love to see it. Spinach? I can't remember if we did spinach. Black seeds now? I feel like we need to get more wheat. I don't think I did spinach. Did I do spinach? I can't remember. Let's go into your inner world, I guess, and see what... Whoa! What the heck? Oh god, she looks disturbed. Unlock the chain, comb her hair, the girl in the bird cage, story of the bow, Lori's bells. I'm so glad they didn't typo that E into an A. Um, okay, let me hear you out, I guess. These are the chains. The girl who is entangled in chains, her heart is locked. Are you Kenzella? What are you doing here? Why are there so many ch chains? I'm, if not chained, they will leave me. It seems that answer is wrong. Let's come back tomorrow. Aha! I see. Okay. I think I'm starting to understand the inner world a little bit. I have to ask the right questions. You know? Right? Hello? I would like to purchase myself a new outfit today. Time is precious. Spit it out. I'm gonna spit you out. Hey, Ludacris. How you doing, Ludacris? Spy, how's it going? Good to see ya. Hey, Cassie. How you doing, Cassie? Hey, Little Miss Teddy. How you doing, Little Miss Teddy? Happy Easter to you, too, as well. Yeah, happy Easter to you, as well, Chris. When my time at Porsche came out, it was rough and it changed a lot. So, yeah, exactly. My time at Porsche definitely was one of those games that... Uh, oh, we need flax. Shoot, sorry, my bad. Uh, my time at Porsche was definitely a rough one when it came out. But this is the outfit I really like. 
iron ore. That, that, that's, a, that's a spicy outfit too, dude. That's a spicy outfit. You know, if she's going into inner world, she better put her sleeves up. Right? Right. We need flax. Um, let's see here. Alright, let's go find Croc. Hello, Croc. Where are you? Croc's over here, right? He should be over here. This is where his building is at, right? Unless he's not at work yet. Or he hangs out here. Alright, let's find Croc. Croc! Where are you, buddy? You're way up here. You're at home. Okay, you probably have like the day off or something. All right, let's let's we'll, we'll go to him. Yeah. Perfect. Let's go. Have a good one, Alex. Take care. Do take care. Thanks for hanging out with us as well. Rock, rock. I just want to say I love how kind Chan is. Oh, it's great. Absolutely. That's how we do it here. We keep it real. We keep it real and we keep it safe. That's right. Yes, hello, Croc. I'm resting. Don't disturb me. I got your badge for you. You're going to give me 16 iron ores? Yes, that's the badge. Thank you. I won't forget your help. These iron ores are a token of my gratitude. If nothing else, you may leave now. I would like to be alone. Oh, well, okay. That that's that's fine. Yeah, I, you know, space boundaries. I get it. Yeah. Have a good day. All right. I understand. Yeah. Is it Bur uh, Cassie's birthday? It's your birthday tomorrow on Easter Sunday. Oh, fantastic! That's awesome. Happy birthday. Happy early birthday, I guess you could say, right? Big shout to you. Love to hear that. Uh, hello. I've done did your duties, I believe. Ugh, after sorting out- no, 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 no financial statements, please. If you want me to fix the Piggy Express station on the back hill, you only need to bring 3,000 gold to Wallace. Have you ever been to the mountain behind the town? It is a place rich in resources. Many good, many people go there to collect resources. Now the farm just started recovering. Uh, you must be, you must be in need of those resources, right? But the farm is too far from the Black Hill, Back Hill. Unfortunately, there is a Piggy Express station on the Back Hill, although it has been in disrepair. Even the pigs have all run away, but it's not difficult to repair. This is crazy because. They refer it to the piggy station and all that, but then they refer it to a bus station. I don't know what the heck they're talking about. If you need this, as soon as you have the funds ready, I will help you find someone to repair it. Yeah, I'm ready. Thank you. You have been very helpful. I'll arrange for someone to fix it right away. After Back Hill's uh, pig station is repaired, it will be much easier to travel between the town and Back Hill. I'll write to you when it's repaired. Wait for my good news. Okay, I will wait for your good news. Miss Wallace. You know what? Actually, now, let's go into her inner world. I know what you might be thinking. Oh my god. Again, here we go. But, now that I'm starting to understand the inner world in a non... In a very untouchy manner here, I think I could... Uh, I think I could probably uh, get it going, right? Yeah. Opinions of me. Um, in my opinion, Kenzella is a very reliable person. Thank you. I like it. Talk about hobbies. She doesn't want to talk about the hobbies. Concerns. Huh? What's on your mind? Sorry, did I worry you? I'm just a little down today. Once, there were newcomers like you who moved to this town, but in the end, they all chose to leave. <laughs> I'm gonna be completely honest with you. I know why they left. Although I have faith in you, sometimes I can't help but wonder if you will stay, will you? Uh... <laughs> Of course. Great, then let's both work harder. Yeah. Don't touch your knee. Dead flower. Withered tulip. Withered tulips 
Could they bloom again? By the way, you don't know yet, do you? The town was once a very prosperous place. The legends of the goddesses surrounding this place attracted many people to this town who longed for protection. But gradually, people stopped believing in the existence of the goddesses or those legends about her. They began to dislike the quietness of the town and started to yearn for the outside world. Finally, many people left here one after another. Candela, look, these tulips also once had a splendid flowering season, but they could not escape the fate of withering. Will I be able to make them bloom again? Absolutely. Encourage her. Yes, I, I can't give up. I'm the secretary of the town. These tulips are sure to bloom again. Yeah, absolutely. They're sure to bloom again. There we go. Encouragement. I like it. See, I'm starting to get it now. I'm starting to get it. I'm, I'm not touching her knee. <laughs> Is there anything I can help you with? There's something on your face? Wait, what? Where? Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Sorry. Talk about hobbies now. She doesn't want to talk about that right now. Understandably. Let's talk about that. A flower pot. An unknown seed. Could it have a special meaning? I plant a seed for every person who comes to the town, hoping that he or she will take root in the town. In this flower pot, it is... In this flower pot is the seed I planted for you. Maybe one day, when we are close, it will blossom for you. Yes. It's... Yep. Yep. That's exactly what we want. We want it to blossom. Anything else I can click on you? Please don't touch them. They are fragile at the moment. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, all right. All right. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Anything else I could do? Talk about Croc. Actually, I don't know much about Croc. This is my fault and negligence as the town secretary. Uh, but I saw him drinking juice alone at Moon Bay restaurant on several weekends, uh, weekend nights. It's really worrying. Juice? He's drinking juice. Why is that worrying? A choir? Success rate? No. No, 5%. Yeah. 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 Understandably. Understandably. Yep. Whoa, look at that. There's the market on the weekend. They got balloons and everything. Oh, how cool is that? Holy moly. Hello, everybody. Why? Hello, this is so cool. Tianchi. Tianchi? All kinds of precious gemstones. Just have a look. Ruby. Are you considering moving to town? Only the town mayor can recruit members. <gasps> Are these people that you can actually bring to the town with the empty spaces? Oh, that would be brilliant. Hello, Goo Goo. Gaga. <laughs> Iris. These are new characters, dude. I really want to eat apples that are not poisonous. I agree. Job hunting. Hope to obtain 15 apples. Can join town after you reach it. Oh. Oh. All right. Okay. Okay, okay. I feel you. Jolin. I need a batch of stone. His hometown is... Oh my lord, there's so much to go here. Switch info? Wait, what's the info? Oh. Expected salary? 2000 a month? Uh, this is not that... You know. Sell lumber for 500 Transaction complete, and we got friendship points. Can I enter your inner world? <laughs> Hella. <laughs> What a hell of a name that is. My goodness. Hey, Millie. How you doing, Millie? Oh, my lord. Hey, Moonflower. How you doing, Moonflower? Chocolate any, of the, any time of the day for me? I agree. Well, this is hella. Because she might be hella fine. I don't know. What the heck that's all about. Interesting name choice. Willie. Hey, Willie, fresh fish, great for steaming, stewing, and grilling. Wait, there's two fish people? You and Hella? Rhodes Mystery Shop. Uh-oh, here we go. Road. oh dear, welcome. 
There is a piece of great news to tell you. Just now, you became the 2,333rd newest customer to visit our store. Newest customer? Dear customer, here is something you don't know. The Gold Ranch is just a small property of mine. On the weekends, I, Road, take on a different role and sell surprises in this mystery shop. Just in time, you can now take a look at the popular product in our store, Mystery Gift Box. In order to give each customer a big enough surprise, I randomly put a carefully selected premium product in each gift box, which guarantees great value for money. Oh dear, speaking of which, last time I guess got a diamond from the gift box, but it really made my heart ache. Really? There's such a, such good things in it? You are lying to me, aren't you? Oh dear. Dear customer, honesty is the foundation of doing business. Only products full of sincerity can win the hearts of customers. But luck is like the direction of the wind. It changes rapidly. Not every customer has the good luck of getting a pleasant surprise. But I, Rode, uh, believe that a lucky person like you, the guest, will definitely be able to reap surprises. Dear customer, if you want to try your luck, visit Rode's mystery shop. I can go into his inner world. <laughs> Dear customer, try your luck and get Rhodes Mystery Gift Box. Let's see. For only 1% off, you can buy it for 900. Yeah, might as well. Send me, dude. I don't care. I'm curious. What did it give me? Congratulations on getting... I don't know what I leveled up. Oh, congratulations on getting 50 flower petals at a... All right, you son of a gun. I've been robbed. I've been robbed! Hey, Angelie. How you doing, Angelie? What's going on? Good to see you. Mod, um, is there something you want to buy? Gold Rush Mall? Whoa. Bok choy, carrots, dandelions, fish, mint, corn, apples, coffee bean, peaches, tan- Oh, tangerines! Those don't really show up very often in the, um... In, uh, in, in, in farming games. Either Durand's, either. Sugar canes. Grape. No, grapes too. Purple sweet potatoes. Goji berries don't show up that often either. Okay, nice. Uh, who are you? Buy-in. The Shining Cactus Pulp, the best of the best, great value for the price, do not miss it. Shining Cactus Pulp, very well. well these are kind of interesting characters, pretty cool though. Who are you, did I talk to you? Haida, buying cactus at fair price, very well. The only person I am kind of questioning is the person named Hella. William, dragon fruit are on sale at low prices, hurry up while the quantity is large. Dry fruit haystack. <laughs> okay. I feel like we... Okay. Hello, young person. Hello. So I guess, like, it, when it comes to, like, agree to join... I guess we could get Iris in... If we had 15 apples. I don't know if there's been any apple trees or anything like that. I haven't really kept my eye on apple trees or anything. Okay. Let's go plant some more stuff, yeah? You can brush your teeth with a new and improved fre fish mint. <laughs> That's disgusting. Uh, I kind of wish that music in the town was uh, maybe a couple songs in variation, not the same song over and over, or if the song maybe would change a bit when you were like talking in dialogue or something, talking with people or whatnot. So really all we need to do for our main story quest is harvest three more uh, crops, which should be done by tomorrow. I think we should be able to do that by tomorrow. Let's clear out this land and plant or plant. Yeah, well, yeah, plant. Uh, plant some more stuff. My lord. And then when we need to we need to grow the flax, because if we want to get a new outfit, we got to get the flax in, baby. Yeah. God, what did I do? Oh no. Is she okay? Oh yeah, she was just tired. Yeah, 
Can anyone give me a quick catch up on what the game is about? Uh, the backstory, there will, it's really hard to really kind of know what is going on. There really hasn't been much of a backstory at all, other than we're like a person that shows up and to a town and at a vel very welcoming town that everybody, you know, all of a sudden we were thrown into a farm and things like that. There's not really a backstory, I don't think. At least I haven't caught on to that. Um, it's more of just like, I would say it's he it's heavily, heavily relied on like the farming part of it and then the NPCs and all their uh, antics, really. It's kind of it's kind of bizarre to explain a little bit. <laughs> True. Is an apple tree distinguishable from other trees, or do you have to hit them? That's 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 a good shout. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure. This thing too, we want to kind of take on the uh, the sacrifice. I mean, that to me that looks like a, a a beetroot or something, right? Some sort of beet. I'll keep my eye on that. I'll try to sacrifice things and see what what that's all about. There you go. Oh, she's a little tired. Uh, we might need to eat something. We can eat the milk. How much stamina does that give us? Oh, <laughs> barely any. That was kind of weak sauce right there. I don't want to eat any of the crops that we have. Uh, do I have actually food on us? I don't. I don't. I don't. Did we actually get that Playboy? A bouquet of roses. Sorry. <laughs> not the not a magazine or anything like that, but after what he was talking about, right? Can we read this book again? Or is it just one time use, maybe? Bouquet of flowers. A bouquet of flowers. Uh, let's go ahead and actually do simple hoeing here. There we go. And then we'll probably plant a few things here. There we go. Plant proficiency, that's good. <laughs> hey, Sarah B, how you doing, Sarah B? I'm back. I'm... I'm back near the start, but just wanted to say this is hilarious in your reactions. I'm loving it. I'm laughing so much. Oh my god, Sarah. Just en en enjoy the ride. Enjoy the ride, Sarah. Enjoy the ride. Because I've been enjoying it. It's been a good ride. I will say. Uh, onions, please. Um, And then let's go like this. <laughs> oh no 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 no! Here we go. Oh, there's a silver one. That's what we need. We need the silver onions. We need three of them. Three silver onions right now. I think that is considered a silver onion too. So that should be our third one. Cool. This guy should be fed already. Yeah, he's already fed. Let me grab a little bit of water. Kinda wanna put some things in here. We'll put like um like this. I don't think we need that. No, we don't need that. We need flax for the outfit. We'll hold on to everything else though. Even the crops. Because we need 20 wheat still for I think our quest as well. Alright, let's go to bed. Call that a day. We have a couple emails that just came in too as well. Yeah. It's so weird. It is, it is, it is strange. They, they call them emails. I mean, email is standing for electronic mail, right? But it's a freaking letter in a mailbox. Ah, um, I'm just here to look around the farm. It's my habit. Dude, you remember you chased me back to the farm? You're crazy, man. Is this farm prettier than me? What the heck? Let me watch it with you. Is there anything worth to see? It doesn't look good now. Once upon a time, there was other people living on the farm. Betty, Uncle Bisman, uh, the Jamie sisters, the Harrisons, and uh, Christy. And they all left here, leaving only these empty houses. I often wonder if they will come back one day. So when I went up free, I come to the farm and look around. 
Yes, yes. I remember Uncle Bisman had a crafting table he would use to make items such as fences, street lamps, to decorate the farm. Maybe this table is still in the house. I mean, let's go have a look, shall we? Okay, yeah, let's do it. Cough, cough, as he says out loud. <laughs> it's still there, as expected. First, let's move it to the sun. Uh, okay. It looks as if it can be used. Just wipe the dust off of it. I mean, Kenzella, uh, this crafting table is one of the legacies of the farm. So I think I'll leave this to you. After all, you are the owner of the farm now. Oh, so we got a crafting table. Nice. After obtaining the crafting table, choose a location to place it. The crafting table can be used to turn materials into various props. Nice. Cool. That will actually be good. Because there's some repairment that we need to do anyways. Email. Wallace, good morning, Kenzella. Back Hills Pig Express has been repaired. You can use it now. In addition, Hazur and Mosu asked me to thank you on their behalf. It will be more convenient to travel between the town and Back Hill in the future. Well, that, that's good. Dues letter. Kenzella, sir. Bro, it's like somebody decided to do the English translation where did they type it did they type it in like the sticky notes did they use like a notepad honestly all you gotta do is like use Microsoft almost Microsoft Word and this stuff will be auto corrected for you what the heck is going on here all you gotta do is copy and paste it don't you Kenzella sir you are recognized by the sword in stone in my friend in my good friend so i thought for a long time and decided to share a secret with you i once found a mysterious altar in the grass of the farm according to my experience it must be prepared for the brave who will save the world as long as you offer the right sacrifice you can get a reward such as noisy Weapons or armor, Kanzella, sir. Oh, I see. You're trying to be a sir. I'm not a sir. If you succeed in sacrificing one day, please be sure to let me know. They use like they space the periods too, and then they they don't you know how they don't space the periods, and then like then over here they space the period. It's driving me nuts. <laughs> I tell you, I tell you, I'm not even a sir. Come on, man. You're driving me nuts. That's right. I'm not a sir. I'm a madam. That's a big onion. Is that an onion? That is an onion. Okay, that's a big onion. Can I sacrifice do? That would be hilarious. <laughs> oh! There's my silver onion. How you doing? go it's it's like the in you know it's, it is kind of interesting because in the beginning of the game you don't you get you, you really you get to choose uh, three characters um, which as the first two are unlocked and then the last character is locked until I think you maybe complete something in the game rather but um it, it's interesting because I mean from the from the look of it they they the game calls the game calls these characters by guys and girls and, and classifies them as guys and girls too especially when they're wearing outfits um, the game says you are a girl or you are a guy right however as far as like NPCs and how they talk to you depending on whether or not you are a girl character or a guy character in this game the NPCs don't address you uh, that way either they don't address you based off of the character model you have they just call you whatever they want to call you it's, it's it's a little strange right i think it's a little strange like if you selected the guy character in the beginning instead of us selecting the girl character right you would think that okay everybody all the npcs would address you as the guy and then you know you select the girl character everybody would address you as the girl right it's it's strange <laughs> it is it's a little strange 
This is the tomatoes, by the way. That's a silver tomato. <laughs> hey, Lucy, how you doing, Lucy? What's going on? Good to see you, Lucy. I am, I am interested. I am interested in the whole crafting table. I'm, I'm very interested in that. I want to see what, like, things we can craft and all that. So to be a guy, you had to choose the fishing option? Well, that's the thing, is uh, the character, when you choose your characters in the beginning, that character is the guy, I guess, in this game, right? And the game kind of tells us that, not directly from that, cr from that selection, but the game tells us it when you are at the clothing store. So when you're at the clothing store, you can buy uh, girl clothes and guy clothes. And it tells you in big red letters that if you buy the guy's clothes, you cannot wear the guy's clothes with the character that I'm that I am right now. Which is weird because why would it even give me the option to? To buy guys clothes if I'm the girl character it's 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 a little strange so in that context you would think that okay that is the guy character then that you can choose in the beginning it's all strange there we go by the way those are massive silver cabbages you love to see we haven't looked into like upgrading uh, tools and things like that either I can't believe it's only the seventh day of the year. <laughs> I do appreciate that the game doesn't like go super, super fast. I do like that. Maybe there's an all gender fluid non-binary and go by every pronoun. You would think, okay, if you would think so, right? If that was the case, then they would let you at least choose your pronouns. You would think, right? And not just call you whatever they want to call you. You know? You would think that would would be it. Right? But then why restrict the clothes? Exactly. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true. It, but then why restrict the clothes if that was the case? Then you wouldn't restrict the clothes, right? Yeah, you wouldn't. Are there 28 days in a year? Um, I think we have a calendar. I think the game and I think they are trying to be open and inclusive in this game. Um, there are 30 days, 30 days. Yeah, 30 days, 30 days in each month for each season. I think they're trying to be inclusive in this game. I just don't know if they are knowing how to be or how to do it or if it again like a whole translation thing i i, I don't know I, i'm not sure I'm, I'm taking a shot in the dark obviously here you know <coughs> let's see here let's go yes this is what we desperately need now let's get that going shall we Let's go here. I actually want to plant more of this, too. But then, I don't know. It, 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 it is tough. Then it's like, well, if they are trying to be more inclusive, then why would they limit your, your clothing options to for girl and guy? Yeah, I don't know. I have no idea. I, 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 I have no idea. I honestly could not tell you. Could not tell you what's going on in this game. I really don't know what's happening. I'm just here for the ride, I guess. I don't know. I put my seatbelt on, you know, and I just said, all right, here we go. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm just here for the ride, baby. I'm here for the ride and for the good times. That's what I'm here for. Yeah, I'll kind of go back to that again. I think, I don't know if the clothing store is open on Sunday, but I'll kind of go back to the clothing store and I'll show uh, people what I mean by that too. 
in case some people haven't seen it yet. There we go. Uh, we do we have the uh, crafting station in our pocket? Yeah. Yeah, right there. Let's go. Seven. That was a hell of a reach for me. Um, let's put it. Maybe can I put it right here? Okay, they don't let you put it right here. Okay, there's a certain boundary. Okay, I get it. Let's just place it right there for now. It's cute. Yeah, it is cute. So fences. Okay, fences. Different kinds of fences. Wheat fences, grape fences. Enclosing walls, enclosures, maybe? I guess if you were to learn those recipes, even with lighting. Decor, butterfly station, stump stools, storage boxes, flower leaf gates, green leaf sofa, strawberry sofa, that's kind of cool. Balloon gates, haze, tools, cabbage sickle, a tool that brings 5% chance of getting an extra bag of cabbage seeds when used for weeding. Oh, that's cool. Remodeling hammer, 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 hammer. A special tool that recycles the decorations placed on the farm and stores them in the backpack, which we I think we already have. I think the fact that the color of this is is gray made me think like made me think that it was grayed out and that we didn't have it. A toy? Bamboo copter? That bamboo copter from your childhood memory, rotate the shaft by rubbing it in between your hands and it will fly up in the air. Oh, okay. Let's do that. Can I do that? Oh, look at that! It was a one-time use, but it was pretty sick. Yeah. That was pretty sick. Let's go see the clothing uh, store. Oh wait, we, did we water this? We didn't water this stuff over here. We gotta water this too. Oh, this isn't ready to- this is ready to harvest. Okay. Round onions. Are the silver crops rare? Probably, yeah. They're probably silver, maybe? I wonder if there's gonna be gold crops or stuff like that. That'd be really cool. I might run out of energy here. I wonder if you could date whichever gender if there is a den yeah yeah i yeah i think you could date whoever you want in this game um and i think that's and, and the reason why i say that is i think it's because we've been hit on super hard by the restaurant lady and we've been hit on super hard by lindy as well <clears throat> because everybody calls us a him in this game right everybody calls us a him and Lindy is still getting us, I guess. And even the, the restaurant lady is getting us, too. So, yeah, I think you could date whoever you want. Let's go here. 3663. We can go like this. Let's actually do this. I'm going to do something different here. Maybe we'll slide in this thing. Can I go like right there? Oh, it has like a giant. Uh... Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. Let's go right there, and we can go all around it, right? All around it. Nice. Nice. <laughs> hey zinc how you doing zinc what is different with the silver vegetables i think they're it's kind of like um you ever play like any of like the stardew valley games story season games you know when you harvest a a crop and you get like a bronze crop a silver crop or 
a gold crop or a purple crop. I think in this game, they literally make your crop silver. I think that's what that is all about. Yeah. Good to see you, Zinc. Hope you're doing well, yeah? Feel free to take a look at the furniture here. Okay. Please find Power and ask him to channel his create creative urges into upgrading your house to level 2. Well, although, uh, I'm sorry, but I want to entrust you with something. My brother Power, Power's creative desire has been so high recently that he doesn't remember to eat recently. Wait, what? So if you can ask my brother to help you upgrade the farmhouse, I think it can let him vent some creative desire. I'm really sorry, but I'll pay, please. Okay. Okay, that, 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 yeah, 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 that's fine. Hi. Urban construction, farm construction. Goo goo bird, sleepy pig enclosure. What is the, what is this, this, this? What is this, like, food thing there? I don't know what that food thing is, that, that beat. Uh, urban, I guess, is it urban construction? Oh, you can go anywhere and do, that's really cool though. I do like the fact that you can go anywhere and kind of upgrade. Oh, this is really neat. Hang on a sec. So if I were to, let's go. Can I go to the, um, if I were to go to uh, the house of mermaid, can I like, oh, I can't see any, any of that. Okay. never mind. I guess. Right. No. Please select the building to act on uh, this building. That one. Upgrade. Oh, oh, blue wood. What the heck is blue wood? Lumber, that, blue wood. Oh, cool. I like it. So what about if I wanted to upgrade um, the blacksmith shop? Opal, star iron, that's cool. I like the fact that you can upgrade other uh, shops around the, around the world. Cool, 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 I like it. Is this just on Steam? Yeah, I believe it's just on Steam, yeah. It's early access. It could come to, like, maybe Switch, possibly even console in the future. Uh, probably when it will, when it's full release, though. So, that'd be about, like, a year or more. Yeah, typically that's what happens with these games. Little, oh, this GU again. Little cutie, I know quite a fairy tales. Yeah, yeah, you and your cute stuff. Okay, we need to give, give her a silver onion, three silver onions. We're, we just gotta wait for them to grow. We have them, we just gotta wait for them to grow. Go. We done that, so he's gonna give us log fences now. Hi, young person. You have already harvested 30 crops successfully. Br brilliant. It seems that you are one step closer to becoming a great farm owner. Take these fences. You deserve them. You can use them to decorate your farm and make it more stylish. How to use fences? You can go to the creation workshop and talk to Pauline, the furniture st store owner, to buy fences. You can also make fences from materials by the crafting table. Uh, when placing fences at farm, adjacent fences will connect together automatically. Okay, cool. Nice. I like it. Liz. Again, uh, with the Liz thing. Who is Liz? So Hart wants you to go to the blacksmith shop to order a red copper kettle and take the blank to the blank. Oh, and take the opportunity to get closer with Sakona. Young person, have you said hello to Sakona at the smithy yet? In the future, your farm will uh, inevitab inevitably uh, involve going to the smithy to make new tools. I hope you can get along with well with her. She's a little cold towards me. Sigh. How about this? I have a task for you. When you have time, please go to the smithy and ask Sakona to build a copper kettle. Wait, I thought I said a red kettle. Again, did I re... Did I read that wrong, or did it say Red Kettle? I'm pretty sure it said Red Kettle. And you can also take this opportunity to have a chat with Sakona, so she is not alone all the time. I know that in the eyes of most people, she is a little aloof, but I believe that is not who she really is on the inside. Very well. Little cutie, did you make a special trip to come hang with me? No. I did not. Copper is a kind of red? Yeah, but why would they say, go get a red uh, thing, and then say, oh yeah, by the way, pick up a... You know, go get a red kettle, and then, oh hey, by the way, go get a copper kettle? You just call a copper a copper. 
Let's be like, hey, can you go give me a blue kettle? Oh, and by the way, make sure to give me that uh, cyan kettle. <laughs> What's up? I don't know. You tell me, Sakuna. Manufacturing tools. Red copper. Oh, they call it red copper. Okay. Red copper is what they call it. Got it. He said a kettle, right? I'm pretty sure he said kettle. We can actually do this. A sign? I'll take it. Received order can be viewed on the board to the side. There's a board? Hey, Phantom Star. How you doing, Phantom Star? What's going on? Where's the board at? Is there a board? Where's the board at? On the board on the side? Are you talking this? Are they talking this? What are they talking? Board on the side. Am I not seeing it? I don't see it. I'm asking too many questions. <laughs> Did they mean the board on the, on the, in the village? Is that the board over there? That's a fence, right? They mean the board back at, at, at the town, maybe? I don't know, I guess. I guess the job board? Let's go to the job board, right? <laughs> Notices Purchase catfish Lumber Mining I mean these are easy quests for sure I don't know what the heck they were talking about About the board Who knows Yeah, Rumi, how you doing, Rumi? This board. Ah! There you go. Found it. One day. So that board. That little sandwich board, you're telling me? My lord. I was looking for, like, a massive... Why is everybody running in a panic? Everybody's running in a panic. What? 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 What just happened? Is that how everybody goes home at night? Is they just run? What the heck is happening? <laughs> I don't fully understand these people. It showed a piggy express. Was that me, like, being notified that the Piggy Express was built? Oi, oi, oi. Got home from work. Time to relax and jump in bed after... After, how long are you gonna stream till? I'm gonna be streaming for the next, uh... Like, 40 more minutes? Yeah, 40 more minutes or so. Take a nice shower to cool down after that knee touching. Whoa! <laughs> oh goodness gracious! So funny. It's silly. It is silly. It is very silly. This though, however, this is actually kind of cool. If you're telling me there's other kinds of tools that you can kind of like turn into certain things, like. A refined iron sickle where you can turn a cat like make a cabbage sickle like that to me kind of seems cool, right? Let's go to bed Hey Missy, how you doing Missy? How you doing Missy? What's going on? That's how I go home every morning after working all night. Yeah, this game is available now. You can pick it up and play it today, right now. Yep. 
Uh oh, we got another thing. It's the mayor. Hello, younger. Younger? Are you getting used to live here? <laughs> I'm assuming that's supposed to say, are you getting used to living here? You've taken good care of this farm. You've even completed my requests. Now I can proudly announce that putting you in charge of this farm was the best decision I've ever made. Would you be interested in going on a walk with me? Uh, sure. <laughs> Let's go then. I don't want to get in his inner world. I don't. Uh, what the heck? Bridge? What a clear river. Uh, just like the young me when I first came here, but now I'm an old man. I wonder if Wallace has mentioned to you that there are a lot of people in this town who came from the outside world. And I am one of them. I was not as good as you at the beginning. I could only be a little assistant who would have thought that I would become the mayor later. At that time, the town was very lively. Every night, thousands of lights were on, and there were children running around and playing everywhere. Especially in the darkest time of the world, the rumor that... The rumor that the goddess shelters this town attracts many people to take refuge here. But as the organization which cultivated that hero saved town after town from the darkness, people gradually left. Some of them left because they missed their hometown. Some left to follow in the footsteps of heroes and save the world with, with them. This town may be too quiet. Let's go walk around another place. Okay. Then come with me for a bit longer. All right. Look at that. Have you been here before? It's called the Mushroom House, and it's the tallest building in town. Wallace used to love coming here. She said that from here you could see the scenery of the whole town. I guess so. She's not wrong. It looks good. It looks cool. Speaking of which, a few days ago, I received a letter from my hometown. Many years ago, despite dissuasion, dissuasion, I left my hometown full of pride to find a reclusive master and to learn from him a lost art. I didn't know this art was lost for a reason. After my study was complete and I left, I found this art to be totally useless to others. So I wondered, wandered all the way here, and the mayor at the time took me in and asked me to think about what my real calling was. Then a lot happened. I became the mayor and I vowed to bring the town back to liveliness. But after so long, things didn't change much. Just as I was about to give up, Wallace stayed strong and refused to let go. She always believed that the town could prosper again. I think I'm getting old. When one gets old, there isn't the drive anymore. If I were a young man like you... I'm not a young man! <laughs> You might bring changes to this town. By the way, Thun Court, thank you for subscribing as well. Well, I'm happy to help. <laughs> Knowing your willingness to help, Wallace will be overjoyed. She often says that you are more reliable than most people in this town, a rare normal person. Okay, uh, I won't keep you longer. After hearing me talk so much, you probably think I'm too chatty. Take this big bowl of stewed radish and eat it. Only when you are full will you have the strength to work. Wallace and I have high hopes for you. All right, well, thank you, buddy. You're not a young man? No. <laughs> no. I'm an old soul. That's what I am. <laughs> Madam, oh, whoops. Can you imagine how they'd be if you chose to make friends at the beginning? Wait, what? <laughs> Can you imagine how they'd be if you chose to make friends at the beginning, right? Am I reading that correctly? If you chose... Big brain here. Hey! Yellow! Coming in with the 10 gift and memberships. Holy moly! That was very kind of you. Goodness gracious. My lord. 
That was very kind of you. Thank you very much for that. Big ups to the memberships coming in today. Thank you all for today. M Mouse with a bikini came in hot earlier, like right when the stream started. They were right on it. <laughs> Thank you for that, Yellow. That was very kind. And uh, shout out to all the new members today as well. A lot of new members coming in today. A lot of super chats as well. And tips. And I do appreciate that. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Very kind of you. I hope that I can bring you entertainment on this day of wildness. My god. This game has been insane. That was very sweet of you. Very kind of you, Yellow. Indeed. Big ups to you. Big ups to you. Indeed. Hey, Shreet. How you doing? How's this game so far? It's interesting. It's a very interesting one, for sure. An interesting one. I'm having a, I'm having a good time gameplay-wise. Story-wise... Uh, NPC interaction wise, a little bit questionable, but gameplay wise, I'm having a good time. I appreciate that, Yellow. Yeah, big ups to you. Thank you for that. And uh, on behalf of the 10 people that received that, and behalf of the almost 30 people uh, this stream that had picked up a membership, we say thank you to all those people gifting the memberships. And also, shout out to the people that became memberships to today as well. That became members, sorry. You choose living your life and they're like this? How would they be if you chose making friends? I see. I see. <laughs> when the disembodied voice asked you questions at the very beginning, you chose to find peace for yourself or something? Yeah, that's true. The other option was to make friends. It was like, do you want, and like, it wanted to hide your identity as well, yeah? This is what it was, hide your identity. That was another thing, I believe, right? So maybe people see me in a different, like, maybe we see ourselves like that, but maybe we really aren't that. I don't know, dude. How did I, really, one water? Thank you for your time as well. I appreciate it. Thank you. No, no problem. No problem. I enjoy doing this. Yeah, I do. I do. I do. I do. I have too much fun here. Say hi to Mrs. Cans. Good night from me. Hope I can catch another one another time. Have a good one, Phantom Star. Have a good one. Thanks for hanging out with us. Do take care. <laughs> Get the spinach in. I guess we did get spinach in. We got even silver spinach, too. I'm gonna sell probably all the spinach. I don't think I need all the spinach. I don't think I have... Well, I do have a, a couple uh, seeds that I can still plant. Hey, Shady Knight, how you doing? Need to stop playing these new games. You keep making me want to buy them. <laughs> how you doing, Shady Knight? Totally forgot about that thing in the beginning. It seems so pointless now. I know, right? I know. I, I I kind of forgot it too, right? That we had to like choose those things, unless you know later down the road in the story it will come to some you know some meaning or have some meaning to it. But right now it it doesn't obviously. At least not to our knowledge. It might change though. Plus you know they're gonna be adding to the story with the content, and I wonder what kind of things are going to be adding, story-wise. I'm not sure. Nice. I'm just going to water these, I think, just because. I don't want them to, like, become grass. <clears throat> Holy crap. It's been a hell of a day, though. I tell you. Did I feed the, 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 the goo goo? Did I feed the goo goo? Yeah, I feed the goo goo. I did. I'm gonna kidnap another one. Gigglefish, it's time for dinner. Really enjoyed the stream. Hope to catch another one soon. I hope you do too. And thanks for hanging out with us as well. I know dinner sounds fantastic right now. I'm a little hungry as it is. So it's good to have you here, Gigglefish. Those are just straight up flowers. So, 
Uh, we need to upgrade, you know, our stuff and get all that going and get a bunch of wood and all that. But before I do that, I'll kind of show y'all what I mean in case you weren't here earlier with the whole clothing thing. Just, just to kind of like, you know, I, it's like me saying like, make it make sense type of thing. Also buy some more seeds as well. Uh, oh, uh, yeah, this too, this is actually interesting. Hang on a sec. We went into here, and, um, the hairstyle house, did it have any new hairstyles from the beginning of the game? Right? Can you change everything about yourself? You can change everything about yourself, just about? Holy crap. You can change your character at any... Wow. Okay. That's kind of cool, but no. One thing I wanted to check out was hairstyle research. What the heck was this? Does this do, and why is it here? Right. So let's spend a thousand on this. Maybe it will give us. Oh my god. What the heck? Well, they didn't fix the translation on this. I, I, I'll tell you that. If I could tell you what that was and what that says, I'd tell you, but I can't. <laughs> you know. How you doing, Pixie? How you doing? Good, good to see you. What, what's going on? How you doing? Have a good night, too, Waffle. Do take care. Thanks for hanging out with us as well. Oh my God, no! I didn't want to have it. <laughs> oh no, dude! I can't get another hairstyle. Give me back my other hair. Oh! It was this one. What other ones do we have here? Kind of like that's cute too, right? A thousand dollars. This is highway robbery, dude. I just spent two grand for this guy to mess my hair up and then put my hair back to where it was. What the heck? That was wild. Flower petals, I got that for you. This town needs fashion. I believe you are someone who can understand fashion. So I'll leave this to you no matter what. Help me collect some flower petals. I'm going to make dye. Of course I won't make you do this for nothing. You'll get a reward you deserve for assisting in the birth of a fashion, I guess. All right. It's a weird way to say that. Um, submit. There you go. The perfect stylist with the perfect dye. I have a hunch that I will lead a wave of fashion. By the way, this is the reward you deserve. Also, you are always uh, welcome to come to me for hair styling. I can make you super fashionable. Um, I guess you can only research one hairstyle a day? Interesting. Okay, well, now we know that. <clears throat> Have a good one, Missy. Do take care. Thanks for hanging out with us too as well. Do take care. So this is what I'm talking about when it comes to the clothing options in this game. Um, there's a lot of good clothing options that I like. They look really cute. Uh, and then you like scroll all the way down to the bottom where it gets to the quote unquote guys um, options here. Now again, I don't know why you would even want to buy this, but it says right here, clothing items of the opposite sex cannot be worn after purchase. So what that would tell me is that you would buy it and then um, you just can't wear it. The only thing that I can think that the reason why you would want to buy the opposite sex clothing is if you were to have a, a marriage candidate and then you can change the outfit of your significant other, maybe. That's the only thing that I can uh, kind of grab from that. That's the only reason why you would buy the opposite sex is... Uh, um, yeah, clothing. Uh, view task, please. Flax. Nine. Oh, nine flax, and you give me a linen skirt. Si no, I don't want that color. I don't think I want that color. Would you be willing to do this? I want to design some new clothes, but I'm running low on materials. Go get some flax. I, I kind of want the. Uh, I want the other one though. Can you not give me that one? You, you're you're gonna give me this one for free. Which one? This one, you're gonna give me that one for free? I don't, I mean, it's cute and all. 
but I kind of want that one. <laughs> Can I just choose? <laughs> don't give me the, don't give me the, the, don't give me the leftover one, yeah? Okay. Let's see, we're, we're also gonna need to um, put some stuff away so we can, uh... What do we got going over here? Healthy egg, wheat for bird feed. Oh yeah, we don't, we don't have all the wheat, do we? Yeah, we don't. Okay, let's go back to the farm. Yeah, let's go back to the farm and kind of harvest some wood and things like that for Mr. Uh, Mr. Power. Mr. Power for the upgraded house and things like that. <laughs> yeah, if you enjoyed today's stream, I would appreciate it if you hit the like button and all that good stuff. Um, you know? Show off this game to people that might be questioning uh, whether or not they should purchase it or not. Um, and give them a good idea whether or not it's a good fit for them. Right? This is... I wish this would tell us. Like, this is obviously not spinach. It's obviously not that. Um, right. I don't think it's an onion. It's not an onion. It looks like a beet, dude. That's what it looks like. Like a beetroot or a carrot. It's either a beetroot or a carrot or something like that, right? Yeah. You know what, actually? Let's go take a look at the shop and see possibly, possibly, if they have any new seeds in. Yeah. Thanks for trying new games for us, no problem. Thanks for tuning in on the new games. It's Sometimes it's not easy to have uh, people tune into different games, you know? I do appreciate when people do tune into different games we try on the channel. It helps my sanity out a lot. <laughs> um, let's see here. Pineapples? Hey! Yeah, it looks like that thing that it's asking for. Let's see here. What is this? Uh, summer? Summer? Summer plants? That's it, right there. No, that's not it. Maybe, I don't know. Do you think that's it? Oh, I see. Look at this. Okay, so I didn't realize this. So cauliflower seeds and cotton seeds are locked. Why? Because you have to... Purchasable after shipping 200 units, I guess? Do you unlock them that way? Ah... 10 days after planting? Ah. I see, I see, I see. What about fall? White radish seeds? Okay. White radish seeds. Sunflower seeds? Oh, baby. Fish mint? Honestly, don't know what that is, but that's that. Corn seeds? Grape seeds? More cotton? What about winter? These are all the winter seeds that you can you can grow. Carrot seeds. That might be the thing. Goji berries, purple yams, sugar cane, cotton. Very well. Okay. The snow capped mountain looks like a dragon on the map. <laughs> I like I hit the like button. Not sure about the game, but I love your streams. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Wonder if the quality of the crop had to do anything with that too. That's true. That's yeah. I wonder if, the, if you had to have like some sort of like gold or silver or whatever it might be as well. I, I, I wonder, since the game kind of taught us about, like, crafting and doing, like, the main stories... Actually, that reminds me. What is, like, the main story right now? No main story. So we probably will be, like, talked to by someone eventually. And maybe in the main story, they'll kind of tell you, Oh, by the way, that thing over there that you see on your farm, that's meant for, you know, X, Y, and Z. So we need wood. And we desperately need wood. So let's just start harvesting some stuff. Pick up 
that. I like how it says sacrifice. I know, right? It's kind of... Sacrifice... Sacrifice this radish. Sacrifice this beet. Now, I don't know if trees regrow in this game. Like, if these trees will randomly just regrow. There's a little kind of something here to kind of notice here. This tree is normal. But these trees have blue to them, so I wonder if this is where you get the blue wood. Ah, look at that. Blue wispy tree. Let's shake it. You know, I haven't noticed anything saying anything about, like, apple trees, lemon trees, I don't think, right? Are we even allowed to cut this tree down? Oh! Uh, yep, yep, yep. That's how you get blue wood. That's cool. <laughs> that takes a little bit of time to knock around, but there you get it. You got it. It's nice. Hey, Hanan, how you doing, Hanan? What's going on? Whoops. Brittany Michelle, oh my god, I came back to watch more of the stream. Thought it would be over by now, but it must be a good game. How you doing, Brittany? <laughs> I feel like watching Cans play the game is probably more fun than actually playing the game. I enjoyed the demo, but this has been so much fun. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that, Moxie. That's sweet of you to say. Very sweet of you to say. Whoop. Oh, level up. We're, we're in the Ds. We're in the D letter category now. Now, I can actually eat this stew, too. How much time do we have? Eight? Yeah, let's, let's eat this stew. There we go. That was it? That didn't give me any stamina at all. That was a ripoff, dude. Don't forget the cute high. Hi. Yep. This should be enough wood to get the upgrade done, too, as well. Yeah, this should, this should be enough wood now. We have enough blue wood. We have enough regular wood. We might need more stone. That might be the only thing. We might need more stone. What the heck is this? Oh, you need a higher level hammer to destroy it, right? Oh, I didn't go get my, uh, my, my kettle or copper kettle, right? I guess I have a simple kettle, but I need to go get the, my, um, my other thing, right? That was today. Whoops. Unless I was, unless I did it this morning. I can't remember if I did it this morning or not. Well, you know what? I'll, I'll let it turn over. I'll let it turn over. We're already out of energy as it is. I'll let the day turn over. I should probably put more stuff in here, though. Uh, let's get rid of this. Yep. Um, spinach we'll get rid of as well. Silver white radishes we can get rid of. Don't get rid of the silver onion, though. Cabbages. Look at that 900. For, uh, yeah, silver is where it's at. Get rid of the leaves. Regular onions we could probably get rid of, I believe, too, as well. And the round onions we could probably get rid of as well. Got to keep the wheat and uh, keep the silver onion. Wait, what is this? Silver spinach. We'll, sl we'll sell that one, too. So 6,500 in total. It won't be for tomorrow, because he already came today, but... Good. Alright. Uh, oh! She delivered it! Oh, that's hell of a... Yeah! That's convenient. The tool is ready. Take it. Oh, nice. Oh, I love that. That's a nice feature. See, that's the little things in this game. Like, in other games, you would have to run all the way back to the shop and pick it up yourself. But nah, dude, they just... You know, they dropped it in my email. They said, you know what? You know? Hit me with a Gmail account, and they delivered me a copper uh, water kettle. <laughs> That's convenient. I love that they deliver the tools. Yeah, I, I agree. Is there fertilizer yet? Uh, there might be. I don't know. We haven't discovered any, or the game hasn't taught us anything about fertilizer, but there could be for sure. I was wondering what the health bar is for. Yeah, I think that has to probably do with the mines. Maybe we haven't gone into any mines yet. Oh my God.
Now you definitely look like Lady Gaga. <laughs> Holy crap! I honestly think it's a little terrifying. <laughs> ride it? You can only ride after the animal has reached uh, three hearts? No, dude, I want to ride it now. Will you let me ride you? I'm gonna ride you one of these days and you're gonna like it. You're gonna like it. Here you are. It's gonna be the greatest day of your life. You'll just wait. <laughs> nice, so now we have the upgraded uh, water can. I, I take it. I take it. Have a good one, Moxie. Do take care. Thanks for hanging out with us. Have a good rest of your day. Are these ready to harvest? No, not yet. Alrighty, very cool. Yeah, I like that. I like the whole delivery the tool, you know, deliver the tools to your house, you know, so you don't have to worry about picking them up all the time. Doing this, uh, let alone the upgraded tool here, this will definitely uh, increase our stamina. Well, not increase our stamina, but conserve our stamina, sorry. It looks like a Pokemon? Yeah! Don't you know the Pokemon Goo Goo? <laughs> He's evolved. He's evolved. It's so funny. <laughs> so funny. Oh, this game's silly. Very silly, silly game. It went from Goo Goo, and now it's Gaga. So that's the evolution right there. And then the next evolution is... Mom, can I have the keys for the car? Plant proficiency is now to a B. All right, very good. Nice. Okay, cool. That worked out. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. Uh, quick note. Memos. Extended story. We should be able to do this quest today. No problem. Heart wants you to go back to the blacksmith. Okay, we can go back to Mr. Uh, Mayor, too. There's a couple things we can finish off. There we are. Did I run out of water? I did. Damn it go back and get some water. Oh, here we are. It's so funny, dude. And that was, and you know, the cool thing about the game is that, like, that 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 bird that we have, our Goo Goo, that was just a bird that we found in the wild that we picked up and then we just put it in our corral or put it in our enclosure. So the cool thing that you can actually just go around and, like, pick up a wild animal and then just adopt it I think that's pretty cool, too. Like, you don't have to go and buy one. If you get lucky, you just find one and just take it home with you. You know? That's pretty cool. The music, is the music getting to you? Now, the one thing that would be interesting is to see, like, the other seasons. Uh, see if the music changes and, and things like that. Alright, let's talk to Mr. Power. Hello, good sir. Hi. Um, urban construction. I need you to work on my farmhouse. Upgrade, please. I need more blue wood and more lumber. Frick. And I need more coin, too. Okay. Just a little bit more coin. Well, we'll have that actually by tomorrow because, uh, we have like six grand coming our way. You know, it's also going to be cool to see is the, uh, I guess another thing to kind of note as well is, what the heck? Uh, another thing to note is, not that, this. The festivals, the events that happen every every season, right? Like, I want to know what that all, what that's all about, too. I'm sorry, where's Mr. Hart? Oh, I walked right past him. 
Young person, are you all settled into the life in town? Uh, well, yeah, I think I am. We've had that discussion on top of that building that one time. I wonder if you are getting a bit more familiar with Sokona. Sai, this matter can't be rushed. Thanks for the trip. Uh, these are your rewards. Okay, so now we have enough money for that. Uh, another thing that's actually kind of probably piquing people's interest is can you chop down within the village? Yeah, I guess you can. So if you see a tree, you can take it out and harvest like that. So you can craft or you can uh, harvest even trees in the town. Now the question is, will that tree respawn? And you would hope that it does so that if you went through your entire village and cleared out all the trees, it wouldn't be a naked town anymore, you know? Right? Do I have everything I need now? One more blue wood and a couple more lumbers. Frick. You hold that thought, young man. <laughs> Why I'm choosing this place to do it all? I don't know. It's kind of bad, right? But I guess it's a, nice to be here with all the NPCs and do all, do what they want and then also get the trees as well instead of going all the way back home. Time waits for no one. Break time should be used... Or rest. You're still wanting the flax, okay. Okay. Let's do this. Anybody notice that I'm taking down a tree with a wooden axe? I don't think that would actually work in real life, but that's alright. Maybe I would be surprised. Oh. -ho. We didn't need that tree there anyways. It was blocking the view of the church. Come on now. Let me talk to you, Bruce. A person who builds buildings is called the machine person, all right? We can't use that crafting table in town. That's, that's, uh, that's all right. Wish you could. Let's see here. Three more pieces of wood. Hello. It is said that there's a profession called pop idols. Yeah, we're, we're all about that life. She wants three lumber. You get gold coins out of it. We'll do it. There you go. Easy money there, right? I think we did it, correct? Correct. Okay, good. <laughs> and just give me literally one more tree and we should be good. Let's do this one. Quick and easy. Oh, that actually gave us hardwood, too. Okay, so the regular trees give you hardwood. The blue trees give you blue wood. Okay. Let's upgrade the house. There we are. 3,000? Send it. Upgrade. Uh, we will assign Bruce to it, apparently. Bruce, Bruce, get it? So it takes three days. Time. Three days to do it, I guess. P.E. 300... I, I don't know what that is, but I guess so. So, yeah, there you go. Submit. Oh, he wants stone. Okay. Talk to Pauline. So that just needs to be built. So once it's done, built in three days, then we can talk to Pauline and be, hey, Pauline, you know, I guess we uh, we done did it, right? We, we, we got it going. Yeah, a sec. Special ore? Production diagram of white radish hammer. Do we have special ore? I've had hell I've had I have held 1500 1562 stones, each with its own unique texture. I realize it is time to find a new soul. Maybe I should have done so long ago. And it said that there is a incarnation of water spear by Black Hill Lake. If it have it have blue polyhydro hydro crystals, the curves of Pythagoras and the Amora's eyes of nymphs. Holy crap. Please bring it to me. Very well. Special ore. I guess that's one thing we haven't gone to. We haven't gone to the back hill, so let's take a trip to the back hill. Hey Darnell, how you doing Darnell? You started watching when you were, we were streaming Oregon Trail? Oh, very good. 
That's a good little series there. That was a fun series indeed. I had a good time with that. Yeah. Good to see you, Darnell. Hope you're doing well. <laughs> All right. Now I did see uh, Faina, Fe Feyra, Fe Leia. I have a little bit of a quest, I think, over her head. <laughs> hey, Payne, how you doing, Payne? Good to see you. I made you buy it? Oh, nice. Very good. Is there any book you want? Please, help yourself. What do you have for you? Fruit Sweet Soup. Okay. We'll collect the quest, I guess. Oh, look at that little wave. It's, it's Kenzella. Are you here to read books? Freya just read a very interesting book. The book, the book is talking about, ah, she fell again. Oh no. So, so hungry. I'm out of strength. Freya is reading and forgetting the time again. No, I cannot remember for how many days I haven't eaten. Oh, yeah, yeah. Freya, Freya, Freya. Uh, I really wants to drink. I, I really want to drink sweet fruit soup. My lord. You're a lot, aren't you, girl? No, no, don't tell me about procrastination and all that. Now, but this should take us, right? This should take us... Oh, wait. Unless we have to activate it. We might have to activate it. The back hill. I'll just walk there, then. <laughs> so high maintenance. There's a lot going on there, man. She on all type of things. Is there a bridge? A log. Now the question probably a lot of people are asking or probably thinking in their heads or maybe a burning question I guess is is this game worth $17.99 or actually let me rephrase that is this game worth $19.99 USD 10% off for the first seven days it being out um it's a good question typically how I uh rate games is based off of Hold that thought. Beehives can sometimes be seen on trees and can be dropped by throwing rocks or shaking the tree. You can throw rocks in this game? I didn't know you could throw stuff in this game. All right. New construction blueprint, Nectar Drink Master. Haha, <laughs> very well. Anyways, uh, yeah, so back to the, to, the, to the question at hand here. Typically I rate my games dollar per hour. So in that sense, could you get a dollar per hour out of this game? Yeah. Easy, you could probably get 20 hours super easy out of this game. No problem there. Uh, but also, like, gameplay-wise, visually, I think it's also worth it. I think the gameplay has been very smooth. Um, it's running good. It is. It's running good. There's maybe a minor minor bugs here and there, but it's release day for the most part. Um, you know, that stuff is expected to happen. Uh, that's you know stuff can be easily fixed up on on hot hot fixes and things like that uh there will be more content added to this game eventually as well so you know i guess it's only good news going forward uh if you can get, get past the silly uh dialogue in this game because the dialogue is a little kind of crazy and a little bit different uh than most of your farming sim games um you know it's it's a little bit out, out there, for, for sure. And there's a lot of translation, I think, uh, issues going on there. Um, there's also cursing in the dialogue for a farming game, which is interesting. Um, I did not expect that. If you can get past that, I guess, uh, that's easy, I guess, to get by. Because, again, those things, the dialogue, the NPC interactions, those are things that can be adjusted. Those are dialogue reading prompts that can be adjusted fixed and things like that for when full release comes out so i i think i honestly 
if you're really into farming sim games and really into like doing this and then experiencing a world and crafting and upgrading building i think this is a is a good buy personally i bought this game myself i wasn't given a key or anything like that so i did fully just buy this game myself because i actually had high hopes for it and all that good stuff and i don't regret buying the game for sure now with that being said look at this there's a hot springs here very Harv harvest moon-esque yeah hello kinzilla okay is there anything you want to buy uh oh uh no i don't think so <laughs> i don't think so yo yo no everybody's leaving girl kinzilla hello those birds are all are all cute you want to take any of them home oh maybe Darnell, thank you for the super sticker. Thank you for that. That was very nice of you, Darnell. Thank you for the super chat. Super chat, super sticker. That was very generous of you, too, as well. Thank you very much, Darnell. Big ups to you. Big ups to you, indeed. That was very kind. Very, very kind to you. How are you doing today? Good to see ya. After calming Goo Goo Bird, Gotel has Sir and Avery. Feed for Goo Goo Bird. Kenzella, would you like to help? Excellent. Sometimes I can't take care of so many animals myself. It would be nice if you would like to take care of them with me. You just need to touch them gently. These animals are very compliant. Okay. The question is, will you play it again? Uh, that all depends on how people receive this game. If people want to see more of it, then I am gladly to play more of it. For sure, yeah. And it all depends if people want to see more of it. And the best way... To have that and have that voice be heard is hitting the like button and commenting down below if you are watching this in the VOD and not watching this live and things like that. This looks like a sort of game that you would like. And yeah, and you know, early access, you just think it's just going to get better as time uh, goes on, right? Yeah. Very kind of you, Darnell. Thank you very much. Hey, Ryan. How you doing, Ryan? Love your channel. It's massively calming. Oh, I appreciate that, Ryan. Thank you, Ryan. Look, look at the cows. <laughs> That's what my guinea pigs do when I give them lettuce. They go like this. All right. Well, they don't do that. <laughs> The joke fell on its face. They're called bubble cows. <laughs> kind of reminds me of like when Story of Seasons, you know, in uh, Friends of Mineral Town, right? The strawberry cows and the coffee cows. A mute, um, oh, a mutton sheep. I thought that said a mutant sheep. You back again? You fell asleep? Oh, very good. Oh, thank you, Alex. I appreciate it. <clears throat> Which is kind of crazy because I do, from time to time, I do, I do get a little loud and a little bit rowdy sometimes, and I do get, you know, I start yelling. But it's not my doing; it's the game's doing. Like today, when we grab someone in the, uh, in between the sheets in between the legs whatever one you want to go for there i thought i was going to get in between the sheets with them but apparently not kind of crazy now it's interesting with this back hill and all these animals here that um i wonder if these are just animals that you could eventually adopt out of the wild maybe who knows who knows I grabbed him in the hoo-ha and I grabbed him in the knees. Yeah, we had both going on. We had the knee game coming up strong and then we had the hoo-ha coming up strong. And then I think I grabbed, uh, I grabbed Mr. Uh, Mr. Oh, look at that cute little piggy. I think I grabbed the, uh, Lindy on the junk. And he's like, I, I know I like it. He, 
the response he grabbed him grabbed him by the junk but his response was fantastic like oh uh, i like a girl who's wait well he did did he say girl now thinking about it i don't know if he said girl i think he might have did he say girl oh i gotta rewind now and see if he said girl because he's like i like someone who uh, who takes initiative but let's not touch me there right now <laughs> it was weird dude so weird if I activate this, can I take Piggy with me? I can't take Piggy with me. I can't transport Piggy. Dang it. You missed that bit? Oh, yeah. You must have missed that bit. <laughs> I know the nighttime music is pretty good, right? What the heck route was that? You took a weird route there, Mr. Piggy. And there's our cuckoo. Sorry, not our cuckoo. Our goo goo, who evolved into a gaga. Can I ride you yet? Not yet. I want to ride him so bad. Nice. Is that what he said? He liked girls who took. Uh, he liked girls who took initiative, which is interesting because everybody. Everybody uh, refers to me as a guy in this game. That's what she said. Let's go to sleep. We will go to sleep. And with that, we will get struck by lightning. What is going on? Oh my God. What was that? Um... Many questions. What the heck was that? Those questions might get answered in the next one. Thank you for hanging out with me today. Hope you all enjoyed five hours of Song of the Prairie. We have played five hours Song of the Prairie. This was the first five hours of Song of the Prairie. If you enjoyed this, you want to see more and see what happens in the future because lightning just struck. Hit the like button. I'll be glad to bring you back some more Song of the Prairie and have a good time with you and uh, and uh, interact with these NPCs to some degree and maybe get into everybody else's inner worlds. It's been a pleasure being with you today. A big shout out to a lot of people that came in and uh, showed their support today. Really appreciate it. Mouse in a Bikini with the 10 gifted memberships. Thank you very much, Mouse in a Bikini. Zaris for the 5 gifted memberships. Thank you for that too as well. Also, Mouse in a Bikini uh, super chatted uh, as well. Thank you. For the super chat as well carmen carmen also um uh, decided to become a member today so shout out to carmen so thank you carmen for becoming a member german road crew also tipped uh 20 hey mouse and bikini comes in with another super chat thank you for being you oh thank you mouse and bikini for that that was very kind of you thank you for that and also, Mouse and Bikini, thank you for re-upping your membership for uh, the, the big one. The big one. The, the business in the tier. The biz, business tier one. Thank you for that. That was very kind of you as well. Super, super generous. Thank you, German Road Crew, for the tip today as well. And Treasury of Tomes. Tombs. I'm probably messing that one up. Tomes, probably. Treasury of Tomes. Thank you for becoming a member of the channel also. Yellow with the 10 gifted memberships as well. And Darnell with the super chat. And then once again, thank you, Mouse in a Bikini, for that super chat. If you became a member and you are new to the channel, and this is your first time having a membership, make sure to go over to the membership tab or go to the home, pan, home channel of home screen channel. Scroll down and you can see membership videos and membership live streams we've done in the past. We're going to be doing a members live stream this month for April because we do one at least once a month. So that should be good fun. <laughs> And then uh, I do a lot of giveaways for members as well. So we just wrapped up, uh, I think, a few giveaways here this last week. So, yeah. Anyways, thank you for hanging out with me. Um, that's a tiny bikini to fit on a mouse. Facts. <laughs> Anyways, thank you all. I'm going to go eat. And I'm going to go spend some time with Danielle. Because she has a four-day weekend. Pretty cool. You can follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Twitter. Don't follow me on TikTok, and you can help support on Patreon as well. You can join to become a member, and if you are interested in glasses, some blue light glasses that are prescription-based, 
uh, you can use my code CANS for 20% off at Gamer Advantage. You can also buy merch from me from shopcans.com. And I will see you all in tomorrow's stream. And do as always, take care.